for. <laughs> What's that? Hold on. I just got Lodge Mahal. Yeah. From the Lodge Mahal in beautiful Austin, yeah. Texas, yeah. welcome the to the Lodge live stream yeah. Sunday yeah. edition. Yeah. Special PLO game today. Slick Rick, along with Skull Mike for a brief hour or so before you head on out, but Skull, that, uh, Jesse, the 5, 5 10, 25, PLO, Sweetwacker, T1000, yeah, Stephen Jones, T-Fund, Hiker, looking sharp with his bolo tie. And it's, it's Yoda on top of a VW Bug. Yeah, it's hard to wear the bolo tie with the microphone, though. You see, if he was really thinking, he should put the microphone on the... On the jacket, don't you think? It's almost better than Let the bolo cards. shine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Let the bolo shine. <laughs> All right, PLO it's folks, you know how it works. You must use two out of your hand, like three from the board. It's not like Hold'em where you can play the board. You got to play two from your hand and only two. We got to see four, you know. Your best two. Your best two with the best three there and to make a hand. So right. we're going to be seeing a lot of cards. That and it's Lisa, OG Lisa in the box. Brittany is our game host as we see two spades on this flop. You see that Sweet Walk Whacker flopped a nut spade draw. It's nice to not be able to have it for five, six hours. And then you're forced to talk to people. And a pair of kings from Mazur. 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 He'll fold. Uh, so, so is it Sumit right. okay. and uh, Ma yeah. Mazur? Oh, Sumit. What game are you interested in? There's the check mark for Sweetwacker with the nut flush. Oh. So I'm in two, two leagues. <clears throat> and Sweetwacker wearing the old school Lodge Livestream Lodge Mahal shirt. That, that shirt's pretty strong. Matches the hat, the beard. That's a pretty fresh shirt right there. So Stack sizes. We're playing 2K. Yeah. Match the stack. So everybody started off with the 2K yeah, marker, and I imagine that these the stacks are going to, to have phones. blossom rather yeah, quickly. Kid said, hey, we kind of like talking. <laughs> yeah. Do they put them in yonder bags? When do they? I think you just have to leave it in your vehicle. Really? You can't even take it inside the gate. Really? Oh. Huh. Just getting started, there's Trust Fund Matt wearing his sunglasses as usual. Mahesh, aces, he doesn't have, he has one suited ace. Aces aren't nearly as valuable, valuable in this game. As but you'll Hold take them. Sure. Always nice to look at. Who's got clubs? Suman has the nut clubs. Yeah. Ace are going to go with it with his club draw. King high clubs. Got a pair of tens. So Matt Mahesh will fold his aces. Backdoor diamond draw for Mahesh. Let's it go. So me going nowhere with the nut flush draw. And the ace ten as well. Out there, I'm assuming a PLO here. Yeah, yeah everyone knows each other. There's like three or four PLO games. Okay. Uh, so it's heads up. Every Club every here, day. disaster for Missouri. Two, five. I think it's matched the stack, so it gets big and then unlimited yeah. battles. Oh, wow. Well, okay. The 5-5-10 five, five, has been running more the past couple of months, too. What yeah. a card there from Mazer. Picks up top two. That's a good amount, though. Four tables every three, day. Four tables. Great. Yeah. Must yeah. move. Three All tables, in. one, two, five. That's not All hard. in there. The so it's one, two, five only, yeah. though. Yeah, yesterday we got the... Uh, 5, 10, 25 round. Yeah. Right on it. Just a uh, random day. So. That's good. It was because you were here. M might. Drawing to the nuts <laughs> multiple ways, know. Rick, right? Any jack for Broadway? Broadway? Any club? Uh, I live in Arizona. Okay. I don't think you can lay this down for a yeah, thousand. Yeah, they, they actually get a PLO game. Stick. Yeah, talking stick. I think there's like just, one I or just two played with a kid from Arizona uh, a few weeks ago. He won the tournament here. You might know him. He play, I think he plays for a living. Jonah. Talk about Jonah. Phoenix kid. He won a big tournament here. Nice kid. Tattoos. Uh, Jonah? Jo was it Jonah? Who are you waiting Jonah. on there? Yeah, no. Clubs? Yeah. Young. yeah. Young but tall. Tall dude. Yeah. Mazer will take years. down the first big pot yeah. of the day. Sarah Grotick is in chat. We always cheering on. T1000 yeah, in the 8 seat. Two Already? Grand. Some draws. Brittany is our game host. No clubs? Yeah. yeah. 
or is it just a thousand? I had a, uh, I had a ten on the top, like the flop, flop top pair, top top, ten ten ace nut, with nut clubs. Yeah. But second nut clubs with three pair, and straight draws out the ass. I mean, I had. Some... Yeah, yeah. Unless it was a club. Mm. Straight flush draw too with the clubs. Yeah, I was I, one thinking of reporting you on the flop itself. But I have yeah. too many options. Yeah. Oh, we can only have twenty five. True that. Uh, oh, I want to just. And uh, straight flush. I'll add five hundred. Oh, we can open that. Yeah, you can add the jack. Friendly game. It is match the stack, so players are already <laughs> capping up to. The king helped me a lot. It won't be long. <laughs> Mazer stack. I added five hundred. Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> the one more. One. Double straddle. Trust fund Matt puts the hundred on. As if this game needed any more juice. Players may be playing the knit game at some point today. Cupcakes in chat. You think it's Pocket Kings applies in PLO? I think so. <laughs> That's what I was reading in the fine print. PLO counts as well. Back to Trust Fund Matt, and he's going to make it 600. <laughs> 10 10 8 7 double suited for Mazer. And the price is 600 to go. So 25% of your stack already in pre. He's in there. Suited ace three, queen nine. For Stephen Jones. And he's in there. So we're going to go five ways guys. to the flop. <laughs> Already 3,000 in the skillet. Lisa's going to give us that flop. The other decision I was thinking. <laughs> the nine. Little open ender with a wrap. He's got the wrap, seven, eight, ten. Stephen's got the nine and the nut well, so clubs. Pre -flop, then I, I was going to rip it. I should have, honestly, because maybe, I mean, I'm probably not taking it down, but. Why would you rip ace three, queen nine? <laughs> Seems a bit aggressive. Mahesh just has ace nine right now with not much backdoor potential. And he's thinking about continuing for his entire stack. Am I missing something, Rick? Don't do it, Mahesh. Mahesh is wearing his uniform. We do twice. Whatever, whatever you want to do. I'll do it twice. Can you do that? It's all in. Second hand in a row, we've had it all in. They're going to run it twice. Okay. Yeah. That's all options. You're blocking your own out. Oh, I know. I know. I was hoping my 1500 was going to block you out. Never, man. It didn't work. Never. We're okay here. A, thank you, Cupcake, for that yeah, super yeah. chat. Oh, yeah. I like your very beer. nice cupcake. You are the Very's man. Blocked. Well, at one of the hours, the tens is already. So the tens currently in the clubs. lead, but equity-wise, yeah. Stephen's ahead. Yeah, we'll five, yeah. low five, close. It's, it's a flip close. as we go yeah, to the low first low board low river. Good. Low five. God damn, queen got you. That'll do. The oh, queen twice, twice, nine twice, twice. Yeah, yeah. will pl play for Stephen Jones. Unless you want to just go once now. No, no, no. <laughs> He'll get the first <laughs> one. Okay. Do some low, diamonds. But, uh, low red. That's a good card for you. Low red. Chop it up. Chop it up. <sighs> the boat for Mazur, Mazur in the second hand. So they'll chop out. that one. one. That is definitely that scooping. Where are all the clubs at, you know? Yeah. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Pot uh, limit Omaha. <laughs> All his what? Rap. <laughs> well, five, five. He's blind. I know one card, but five to Jack. Yeah. <laughs> Every now and then we'll give you a PLO good. stream as some people yeah, really good. love the game. It's a it's probably yeah, one of the fastest time. growing yeah, I'll, segments I'll here at the lodge. Of course, I'll one two yeah. Yeah, and one yeah. three one games are yeah. really yeah, prevalent yeah, holdem wise, but the lodge is fast becoming a PLO mecca. <laughs> Once it came out, you're in. It's too late. All right, fair enough. I should, I'm gonna make them count it when it's done nine five. Stuck to that. Yeah. I just do. I don't know whatever's normal here. Whatever you guys want to do. 
But that's, that makes a lot People more sense. People don't go to the poker <laughs> hospital in PLO. They go to the What's poker the emergency room, room <laughs> in this game. Probably think about the same, same right? Is it mine? Yeah. You guys should play the it? ambulance game instead of the fire truck game for PLO. Yeah, it's... Oh, my goodness. It goes quick. Your call was good. Two hands, all in. Second and third hand. the third hand? Yeah. No, I went all in on the second. Yeah. Wasn't he all in, though, on the second? Or... Yeah, but no one called. Oh, you're saying the call. Oh, okay, so third. Gotta yeah, love Hiker. There. Line was good. Bolo tie. Very nice look for Hiker. Had a good talk with him pre-stream. He went out to dinner with Yoda and F and Bob, Florida Bill, last night. Pizza joint. He said, some pizza joint via 316. I said, no, 313. He said, yeah, that's it. It's even three bets with the ladies. <clears throat> King for Swedwacker, King 10 in the lead here. Now that you got a boat for all three players, Stephen Jones with the Crabs and the Queens. First time in Austin? Yeah. Yeah? Well, pretty much. I mean, I, I was here like one day before, but this Steven will win this. Yeah, New poll <laughs> question. <laughs> pretty, yeah. PLO, dot, dot, dot. Tomorrow. It's awesome? Yeah, I've been playing. It's dangerous. Yeah. Weekend, I have no back. idea what I'm watching. And what does it's PLO really stand like, for? I mean, I had one good meal, but. Good poll? Did you have you know, They sailed the night. And then they sailed the night, yeah. What did you eat? Um, Luchico? Brittany. Yeah. Brittany. Have you been there? Brittany. Yeah. Uh, Brittany. Fire. Fire. Did, did you have it's a, a so good. Good. Like, I love that spot. Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah. Amazing. That's good. Thank you. Tell Mike we need score updates. Miami. Miami <laughs> score I don't know what good. in for now. Yeah, how's water? No score updates for you, water Baser. You're leaving water. early. Shame on no, you. Finally. And then Hill caught the next 10 in a row for something. Yeah. 69 yards. Can you ask him what I bought yeah. in for? How much total I started with? Thank you. Really? I don't remember. Everybody started too. I know, but I added on. I what is remember. T1000 drinking? <laughs> Looks like <laughs> some sort of watermelon <laughs> flavored drink. He's always on some health kick. I'm Nobody knows. Kidding. Somebody get him an ice bath that he could use here in the studio. Do you watch all the streams, but you play PLO? Mm hmm. That's I, I like call them also, but. You, okay, so you play both? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we don't, we don't get very many PLO streams. I think this is the second one. Yes. Really? I've never seen it's not one the second one. in the six it's months or so that I've been watching. I played yeah. every one of them. That's not the second one. <laughs> it's it's more like the sixth <laughs> one. About. The Kings yeah, way out in front for Samit. T-1000 just got back from tennis? Amsterdam, so his mind's a bit cash foggy. Cash. But I mean, yeah. I, if I'm playing Hold'em, it has to be a tournament. Or I'd rather, I'd prefer a tournament. Cash games, PLL, yeah. Although PLO tournaments are pretty fun too. Yeah, I played There's the series. I played the series yeah. this year for the first time in four years. Oh really? So now yeah. a PLO boat PLO for Sweetwacker. Awesome. He nails great, that five on the turn. I, don't, great I didn't PLO. play it. Yeah. How many? How many? I'd imagine there was a. Sh I bet the twenty-five. It's like seven hundred or more. Really? Yeah. It's Five's PLO. full yeah. for Sweetwacker. PLO is not bad either. It wasn't. I didn't you play it. I didn't play it. I got sick. I got COVID. And then I had COVID during the main. And Sumit's going to go they with his pocket no, kings that yeah, are no good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I busted, like, you are middle day three. I just threw one. Right. Sweetwacker says, that. just give me one river. I've got a boat. Come find me. This is my six, too. Yeah. Sumit looking for a cowboy. Just one. Really? First cash is a second? Mm -hmm. yeah. Made it count. I was 0 for 5. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, I think it was my six, yeah. 
Yeah, we had slightly better. Ochi, <laughs> Lisa. I, I don't. I think I busted. I'm not a big one, fan four, four of the, of five the times nickname. I'm a o big fan of her. Ochi Lisa. She's been dealing 21 years. It's her career. She's the original. Looking for a cowboy does not come. I see. And Sweet Whacker's going to stack some meat. Sweet Whacker was just playing Hold'em last night, just a few hours ago, on our stream, wearing the beautiful, beautiful shirt. What's some? This needs to move, right? Because you, you told me to no, give you. Now you're five. Oh, it's five, ten. Yeah. Ah, yeah, 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 yeah. The Almighty. Well, that makes sense. <laughs> Lisa? She I likes the OG. So There's your cumulative winning, Steven. Oh, up 2800. Uh, the main. Just Mazer 1300. Oh, Sweet Whacker 1000. Everyone else loses. So Samit hard. throwing every the party. Pot, every blind. Down 2000. Yeah. But when I think of a gangster, yeah. for I think of John G. Oh, yes. Wow. When I think, like there was like. When I hear four, gangster, I don't. Six. I think of Lisa right away. You know, five hands until we bag. I doubled up three nights Talk to her. during that time. I'm just like staying alive. So you're, she, do you yeah, agree? Just she was pretty day. adamant. <laughs> 10, 11 hours. Dude, just, yeah, just short. Short. All right. For like three or four days. And playing, and just playing discipline. Playing yeah. Patience, playing patience. Really just patient. Yeah. You can in that one. You know, you no. <laughs> and then one of the days I got lucky, like two big hands. We ran it out. Yeah. Sweet Whacker my, folds. Uh, Trips in your hand, never good kind of in this game. PLO with, made a deep run. Uh, Chris Kimmel. He got, uh, I think he got like 13 Four or 14. Four of the same oh. suit, not really too good in this game if I saw as him, a I starter. Think. Double suited ace, five, ten, nine. Pierre? That's pretty good. Yeah, he was, yes. he was top 15. He was very, very, really close. How deep did Pierre go? Uh, Pierre's middle, like day 70. He's like, oh, my God. Yeah, I got like 100 100, 150th or something like okay. that. They were, they were they were saying the other day. What did they pay the top what? They paid, a couple uh, hearts for T1000. 1500? 1500? Yeah. Nobody with the king. That's awesome. Thanks, yeah. yeah. Pair of Pretty tens true. for Sumit. Yeah. yeah, it is. It's all of our dreams. But the T-1000 will take it down with the nut hearts, pair of nines. Going with, is that white or lavender hoodie? I played a... Um, it's not white. I played a good amount with Daniel. I like lavender. In Florida back in the day. Oh, yeah? Uh, yeah, He's, I got to see him. He came in a few weeks ago. He's a grinder, huh? Uh... Yeah. He's always, he's always been real, real good. He's a nice but player. he uh, he's been good at all the games. Yeah, he plays. Oh, he plays, plays everything. everything. Yeah, plays a lot of PLO. BW Bug agrees with me. Yeah. It's lavender. It's lavender. Yeah, it's a good call. That's white. Sweetbacker's shirt, outside the logo. That's white. Yes. I'm racing a Randy this year. Yeah, he's. I'm from Tampa. I used to play a bunch. I of was games. playing with him at the on the. Main feature table for a bit. Yeah. yeah. Trust fund Matt raises it here. He, yeah, he got second too. Yeah. yeah. I also final table the Colossus with him years ago. So I just keep. Four bets to 600. Games. Yeah, he does. Sweet Whacker suited ace. He seems like a nice guy. Yeah, he's an asshole. He is? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he's my friend, but he's kind of a dick. Okay. I mean, I'm that's not, just I'm his, not that's his, like, he's, 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 he's just softened up. He's had a kid now. He's okay. just married. He's softened up, but he, uh, he loves the game. He's super competitive. Decent flop for yeah, T-Fun. Open, he's ender, top. pair of kings. Yeah. Going to put it all he in. He tries to have, portray that image. Quick call from Sweet Whacker. Don't talk to anyone like that. Yeah. Sweet Whacker's like just, what, open-ended? Open yeah. <laughs> no, he snaps him off backdoor diamonds. Oh. In rough I shape is the sweet whacker. No, oh, there's a lot of aces left. Uh, nobody too confident in this game, but it is top pair for T Fun. Here we go. One time. There is the five. So the straight comes in for T-Fun, but diamonds available for the Sweet Whacker. 
doesn't get it. Why is that not? Very long. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Key fund. Key fund. Mandatory three butt, right? Mm-hmm. And T fund now approaches a five thousand dollar stack. Watch. Achieves that stack. Sweet Wacker's gonna add on. Hand number seven already had multiple all ins, Rick. Buckle your seatbelts. I'll add two. Prepare to be a little bit confused. What does this person have? He had what? Who's in the lead? It's gonna be a lot of that today. On this nice, crisp, cool fall afternoon here at the lodge in Austin. Almost Halloween time. Took my dog for a walk around the block today, and she started barking at some of my neighbor's lawn decorations. Yeah. People, people go crazy with it. Yeah, it's beautiful weather. It's a beautiful game, Potlim in Omaha. <clears throat> so hope called to, the great game. Yeah, I hope to see Joey Jackets coming in. We're going to have a special guest in the bunker a little bit later on. As we see Mahesh and T-1000 come along. Five ways to the flop. Top set for the T-1000. Multiple straight possibilities yeah. for T-Fun. T-Fun with the wrap. And he also has backdoor diamonds. Well, Mahesh knows how deep runs in main events feels. <laughs> Notice this top set, yeah. equity-wise, here in the main event is losing to T Fund. Actually, they're exactly it? even. Basically, it was, uh, it's a flip. On that, wasn't it? Top yeah. set versus the wrap. Million guarantee. <laughs> Final table. Nice. Oh, God. Uh, Dran did kill the final table and ran really bad on the, yeah, you did. <laughs> the final table. <laughs> that meaning Everybody three was, cards you know, you were quite the could help make the straight instead of just the open ender. <clears throat> no clubs in T Fun's hand. Doesn't love it. 2,000. To win about 6,200. And he's going to get away from it. I'll lay it down. T1000, fresh yeah, back from his European game. vacation. It's coming up. Yeah, for sure. Was that the WPT championship? Mm -hmm. That's going to be a good one. And you can rebuy, I think, too. So. Really? Believe he went to Amsterdam, yeah. Prague. Yeah. Are you playing? I'm sure they're just and another just spot. Italy. Italy. Yes, Italy. Yeah. Correct. I'd like 28 percent. Said he didn't get in too much trouble in Amsterdam. Like yeah, but Prague. Definitely yeah. the that's the dream. The got one, dicey. Yeah. But this will be this will yeah, be the second best thing. I mean, they've never had any. Take like. it as you wish. Probably get six thousand people. That's kind of what I'm thinking. T Fun Matt gets always gets extra credit for the hat that he's wearing. The old school Lodge live stream hat. Hiker's going to play a hand. Steven's last day with us. He's going to be leaving us. And there's the an all in moment for Mahesh. He's got just, he's got a suited ace, two aces, two tens, and a suited ace. How much is it? Would have been much better if. Double suited ace, but he'll take it. Pot. <clears throat> he even goes pot. Repotting, trying to isolate Mahesh. <laughs> I got two flush draws, though. 
<laughs> I have one flush draw, so... And aces, right? Steven really only has one flush draw because <laughs> Mahesh has him covered oh, on the diamonds. Is my, am I live? Oh, diamonds, diamonds are dead. Fuck. <laughs> diamonds are dead. Spades are live. Comes eight deuce. <laughs> Wow. It's gonna, yeah, it's gonna be a sick you one. You played Omaha before, I see. <laughs> one time, top set oh, from a hash. <laughs> Spades available, no longer. Yikes. Oh man! And it's over. Trying dead. Nice hand. Nice hand. Diamonds are covered. Set of aces. What have got there too? What have got there? And Mahesh, all business today, says, count my chips, double me up. Let's keep it moving. It was 865. Yep. Rumor has it, Mahesh has never been seen without the WSOP jacket that he's wearing. Nope. Sleeps with it, plays with it. It's the run good jacket. <clears throat> Almost got through my head. of winnings. Stephen Jones up 1875. I wish you had more, I would have folded. But. Sameet and Hiker nine. throw in the party, down a little over 2,000 each. Swedewacker also contributing a little bit today. It's early. Brittany, the game host. Shout out to her in the back. Mazer looks down at the aces. I've got a lower V pip on this than hold them so far. <laughs> I feel it'll pick up. Oh, uh, yeah. Undoubtedly. Really There's the raise from Swede Whacker. <laughs> happens, though. It, it does happen. All of a sudden, your seated 8 3 seems kind of playable. <laughs> <laughs> That's really stretching. <laughs> Four bet to 425 from Mazer. Suited ace. Pair of aces as well. <clears throat> so meet double suited. Jacks will fold, so it's Swedewacker. Do a knit game next hand. Yeah. Get the action Just going a little bit. I mean, Nine eight six do Sweetwacker doesn't give a f. f. Well, notice he's still forty one percent equity, and he flops two pair versus Major's top set. No longer much equity, but he's gonna think he could be good. No diamonds. Major doesn't like that third diamond. I say we do. He's not folding. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Rips it in. Like he announced all in. He did. First time here by the last net game of the night. It included the dealer, the game host, and the commentators. <laughs> tower of look at banana. That. Look at that yeah, tower behind Sweetwacker. I might have missed it. Yeah. Let's see if we can go back and see him. Might look oh, over oh, his shoulder. The, the tower. Funny, uh, World Series circuit comes through. It's really good. Each yeah. of those yellow chips, one thousand dollars, folks. And my family is all from North Carolina. Oh, cool. From, uh, nice work by our yeah, camera staff. Yeah. Also known uh, as Slick Rick at Skull Mike. Yes. In Jasper, Georgia, which is just outside of Atlanta. Yeah, we can't blame any bad slow mos on production. That's all me and Skull. Maybe so if it's a good one, we'll take it. If it's a bad one, it we're sorry. <laughs> Thought I might have missed that one. I got that one at the last yeah, second. Yeah, no, that was good. Perfect timing. Good shot above the fireplace. Of nice leaves changing. Hold me. Autumn. <laughs> this is knit game. Knit game, 50 bucks pop. Yeah. Uh, All right, they the have decided so that at some point they are going to play the knit game. The oh, next yeah, hand. You heard, you heard me. Next hand. She's going to pass them all out. And Samit was very unsure. It is this hand. So everybody Oof. knows about the knit game. 50? PLO, we didn't yeah, really know if PLO good. really needed Perfect. the action of a knit game, but they wanted to try it. You just wanted to wait. Same rules, win. folks, as hold them. That's exactly win a hand, right. must show your winning hand. Nice Can release the knit button. Last one with the knit button. Pays everybody else $50 per hand. 
Who's losing the Nick game? Ooh. Oh, Daniel's finally. I'm going to go game. with uh, <laughs> Sumit. <laughs> I'll take Hiker. Oh. All right, we'll just not, pick one. I'm not proud of my pick. <clears throat> Probably should have gone with Mahesh. Guy change. Let me change to Mahesh. It's a bad pick, but I'm gonna do it anyway. All right. no, no, I changed my mind. I'm keeping Hiker. Original pick. All right. Shame on me. Chatsville is against you now. A set for Trust Fund Matt. Middle set eights. Little oh. open ender for Mazer and Sweet Whacker. And the chips are going in. What was it? Oh, and Matt from work is calling the Sweet Whacker losing. That's a bad pick, Matt. Sorry. Here we go, folks. That escalated quickly. <laughs> You want to do it twice? Since I love I'll it. do it once. I oh, you want once? Yes, but Okay, T-Fun wants to go once. Sweet Whacker likes going yeah, once. And Hold'em would be waiting five minutes for a decision. <laughs> On how many times to run it? <sighs> no, it's just... Oh, you mean to make a call or all that? Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> now he just gets in. Yeah. Real smooth. OG <laughs> Lisa has her work oh, cut out. Fine. We don't want to go today. Five. I'll take an eight <laughs> or a nine. Needs to get these pots accurate. What do you need, bricks? You just need like a deuce and a three? I got that. An ace and a king. Oh, Does that okay. help you guys at all? Uh, I need exactly. a five or a ten as well. Or... Nine, oh, wow. Seven. Okay. Uh, Main I'm, pot I'm, looks I'm, to be about 11,880. Notice the equities. So you find Matt way out in front we really with his play. set. What are we, doing? we have trips over there. We got. Uh, <laughs> we trips. I knew we had that. I mean. He's all in for 34. Like Deuce of hearts. Are you chasing something? Uh, yeah. Right here? You did, yeah. Fuck. Trip eights. You got top set? No. Oh, he has to, six, seven, Jesus. nine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and a deuce. And the deuce. <laughs> Twelve thousand dollar <laughs> pot, Rick. One time. I knew I'd lose three, but. It's a big one. Largest one of the day. What? Drag ton. Jeez. And it's a three-way. Everybody loves yeah, a three-way. Yeah. I got one of the pins. Hey. Diamonds are live. So many fives. Hearts. I need runner hearts. Hearts are live, too. Oh, yeah, Seth did. Yeah, you already said. <laughs> <laughs> Lisa gathering everything Stand perfectly to, to the middle. Thank you. <laughs> he has a six. What? Running sixes. Diamonds. Hard, hard. Oh, yeah, you do have diamonds. There you go. Who's going to turn the flush draw? Excellent job there by Lisa. Here we go one time. Oh. There Jack of hearts. Is Jack of hearts. Mazer with heart. it saying, Lisa so you're saying there's a chance. Oh, five oh. got there. <laughs> the so the seven there. nine yeah. gets there for Swedwacker and Mazer. <laughs> <laughs> and the set goes hearts, down in Lisa. flames. He covers. <laughs> Fucking PLO. What a stupid game. <laughs> it's a great game. The nine seven. The That's dirty nine right? seven guns down the Takes no skills. set of eights. T Fun oh, has been that. scalped. And Mazer and the Swedewhacker with the fist pump and some cash coming back. This is we just have there? to wait. Pot limit oh, Omaha. This is pot limit oh, Omaha. That, that's about as descriptive as you can get. We're still waiting. <laughs> and nobody gets rid of their nit button because they uh, chopped that pot. I know one way the pot could have uh, not been tried. <laughs> that would save us time. <laughs> yeah, that would have been. Bogdan joining us. On more, right? That would have been exactly. much better. Finnan has a crush on <laughs> Bradley. What's going on, people? A little roll call? No one loses. Let's sound the siren. Roll call. No, not no one. It's no time to let us know where you're watching from, so we can give you a shout out. It's time for roll call. Arm wrestle. Yeah, there you go. He hadn't slept in 48 hours. I got to get yeah, shot. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not doing well. That's Lisa. Right <laughs> does an you excellent job at splitting the chips. I don't think it I mean, Yeah, I you have to. I don't know if that's the Yeah, I don't think it counts. Yeah, I mean, it's I, main, I, main poster. 
Clyde Triplett says he loves PLO. Bob Landry from Buda, Texas, just down the road. Harit, checking Not in from India. Open that paw, right? Hey, Harit, check out Seat 2's <laughs> I love it. If you're shirt to today. To, uh, you may recognize the building, the Taj Mahal. What is that? Cody, that checking in from Virginia oh, Beach. It? Robert from Newville, Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Day -day. Call of like Booty. That's it. That's from Costa Rica. You're 25. I'll Thank you all for joining oh. us today. Shit, weather's about Matthew as good as you right now. Yeah. From yeah. Phoenix. And you're re it's really um, close to I don't think the button button is right. I'll probably go next time I come here because I don't, don't want to just right, wait it? there for forever for food. I think I'd rather just go straight to the event and get make sure I'm in. No, yeah, that's right. I was just yeah, I was just big. Alrighty. I'll be back. Yes, I mean. I fell in love with the city right away. Yeah, it's a nice spot. But from San from Mateo, Romania? California. Uh, Sarasota, Tampa. Bogdan area. from Romania. That area. Panda from Israel. Harsh from India. No, it's beautiful. Thank you all for tuning in. Watch your card. T fund. Double suited. T fund or T queens fund. here for a T one thousand. T pot. Read All the chips are in here. Queens. Oh no, it's no, got easy. hearts and clubs as well. Easy call for Chief Fund Matt as he only had yes, 800 remaining. What am I looking for? <clears throat> a bad fold. Man, I made a bad fold too. I'm like, <laughs> oh, he's got queens. <laughs> I didn't see the queens. Who knows? And double suited. <laughs> I had you covered in hearts too if I get it in there. Find looking for spades or some low cards so he can straighten up. He's got four, five, six, four. That's fair. Nine, eight, three. Uh -oh. Parrot. There's oh, a, a decent flop for two fun. Oh, I think I have Ace. two pair. You do have two pair. Ace. And a straight draw. And, a and now flush. There's the flush for T1 and the check mark. It's over. Gotcha. Oh, so you, you don't really have to be ahead. Oh, uh, two? Yeah. <laughs> Pre flop to win in this game. You just gotta pray. <laughs> you just really, gotta be a really good civilian. Yeah, just get it in there and hope. Call your grandmother from hand. time to time. <laughs> and turn and river. Make sure she has her groceries before you come to the poker club. And then you're guaranteed to run good in this game. If you're a good human, if you're an asshole, if you're rude to people on the streets, you're gonna go broke. Chapter 7, PLO. B pips really meaningless in this game. Everybody's going to be high. Todd Rogers, shout out for the great state of Kentucky, where they play PLO bomb pots on the regular. So does the launch. Every dealer change on the one two. Uh, on any hold'em table, every dealer change, we're going to play PLO double board bomb pots. No bomb pots on the stream table though. Not necessary. It also takes too much time. We want to see hands, we want to see blood, and we want to see our favorites. And the Sweet Whacker T-1000 are some of my favorites. Yeah. Pocket 10s for Hiker. He's in there for 120 Queens for Steven Jones. Mahesh got big slick. Speedwhacker is the one who started this mess three betting, and we're going to be going six ways to a flop. Yeah. Two pair for T Fund. <clears throat> Hiker hits his set of tens. Wasting no time. He's not afraid of the 7 8s of the world. Nobody has the 7 8s. Are a couple blockers 
Also, nobody has hearts, but Mahesh has the nut heart and the ace. Nut heart being the dry ace, as they say. Only one heart. Hearts do come. Could try and bluff at this and pot it, representing the nuts. Let's yeah. see if he wants to do it. He will. Yeah, this is common when you have the dry ace and there's three hearts out there. And Hiker Snap here. folds and Mahesh gets it through and shows it. <laughs> I wasn't even sure what I thought. I think I do. I'm not going to look at it. Well, then. He knows he's bluffing. Whenever he's Mahesh shows and starts giggling, he knows. Oh, he's not on that one? Who's commentating? We need a Dolphins update. Yeah, I'll take a Lions update, too. Can we get some? The <laughs> Miami Dolphins score? And the, and the Dolphins. There's and the, the Lodge cam. Score. Yeah, Lions. 15K yeah, guarantee Lions. Sunday afternoon. <clears throat> That's the tournament going on right now. The Jets game, I think, is just starting, too. Look at all those be smiling nice. faces. What time you got? There's Beverly. Uh, this is two hours <laughs> 3.15, I think? Yeah. yeah. So getting ready here in a minute. What time is the... the 3.30. Oh, okay. We got 330, 325. <clears throat> we'll do a little family pot. What? I'm, I'm too cheap. $50 family? <laughs> Save my money there. <laughs> Wow. See, maybe not I'm a, a, team, maybe not a team, team player. That, that's almost that's never right there. There you going go. to He won 1,000. <laughs> he winked at me. Yeah, yeah no shit. Good. Pair of aces. Thanks. Suited ace Saving king. Money. Raises to 425. Sweet whacker with, well, with a sweet whacker hand. And he's going to come along. Hiker with some Broadway cards. Oh, man. And Hiker well, rips it for his remaining 1620. The man came to play to from the Atlanta area. I, I also knew pretty much what I was like for a quarter. Yeah. I paid that chance. VIP <laughs> member of Chatsville too, but I'm like, gambling. For 50. So it's T1000 <laughs> heads up against Hiker. That's way too good. <laughs> As Sweet Whacker. <laughs> no, you, you, you pull off. Uh, makes the call like too. Right and two, just two off. Okay. The jack of jack eight seven four. Jack eight seven four. <laughs> that is pretty good. He was pretty close. I'll <laughs> be doing pretty good. How much? Sixteen seventy for the game. Sixteen seventy. What do you got here? Running it one time. I imagine that's what the sweet whacker wants to do. It's got hope. I had two. I had I mean, queen. One of the better hands I've seen so far, which is not saying much. JC has got like ace king nine seven double suited. They both have the same hands. Hey, uh, <laughs> 420. Okay. Side. Okay. Oh, we're, we're all in. Oh. What else? <laughs> Not double suited. <laughs> Gorgeous aces. What, just, a, what a spot. Just aces. What a spot. Yeah, really. 420? Clean living. 420. And the king, the king, all the king diamonds. Is, that's a nice card all for you, too. I don't know, that Jack 874. The Jack 874 <laughs> looks pretty nice. Notice the equities, <laughs> folks. Can we, it's a, can we get a 3 3 flop? Really? But anybody's ball, ball game here. T1000, even though he's got the pocket well, aces, you want, you want like ace king, just 46% to win here. You want to see a 6 6. Maybe ace high flop. Well, 4 4. <laughs> Not Sweet Whacker. <laughs> Flops a set there. Diamond. Sweet Whacker with 94%. He had the worst hand Black free. Yeah, that's about it. That'll do it. And he's winning $6,100. Sweet Whacker rivers the boat. That dirty, dirty Robbie on the river. Easy game, man. And Sweet Whacker says best hand holds. Sitting on $10,000 real quick. The four was clean, though, and the four was live. Stephen Jones, like, do we need to start with a 2K cap in this game? I said, sir. Adding 5,000. Just wait. You'll be able to add on as much as you like real soon. You can add on up to 10K if he so chooses. 
Maybe it's the shirt, Rick. It is the shirt. There's Slick Rick Skull Mike sitting on top of the Lodge Mahal. Yeah, that's a big difference. I have a, I have a and just moments ago, we saw the Sweet Whacker with no chips. It's got to be close. Adding on some banana. Wines are good this year. And now he's up at the top of the charts, $3,500. Our man hiker, our good friend. What's the man? The big stuff. Throwing right the party down 4,500. Yeah, yeah. I could probably add all. He's at eight or nine now. That was. Uh, the the oh, nurses getting the bed ready. Yeah, maybe he does. Calling the family, maybe letting them know what time visiting hours yeah, are, just in case. case. Least, uh, His uh, patients are on the way. Sure. Sweet Rackers already wanting to color up 15 hands in. He says, get rid of some of these chips, for goodness sakes. Family pot, remember we talked about this. <laughs> he learned his lesson over there a second ago. <laughs> he was out of position. Oh, okay. Trip Thanks. aces for Hiker, Actually, not a good <laughs> starting hand in this I game. I so. And this. Uh, and I need to get rid of this one. Not the best. This one I will keep. So it's got a suited ace. Steven's got uh, kings. We got aces, kings, tens. Oh shoot! Sorry. This one's something. Little rap there from the hash. 9-10 Jack. Any one of those cards, he's going to straighten up. A piece of that? What's the pot? Let's do that. Makes the call. Hiker's gone. Heads up to a turn card. Five green, five black. No assistance for Mahesh. Steven still in the lead. Ah, thank you. Does Mahesh, Mahesh want to put in all like of his no chips? Snaps. That means I'm definitely good, right? And there Maybe it goes. Not. Seven, <laughs> nine, ten, or jack. Whatever you want, sir. It's a lot of cards Mahesh can hit. I have one pair. They're good so far. <clears throat> Time to flip them, Mahesh. I do have a queen, too, under there. I need a 10, 9, 7. Or jack. Chop it up. 10, 9, 7, jack for Mahesh. He's got more outs than he thinks. Hmm. <clears throat> There's the 10. There's the one, one twice. of the outs. One more, one more. Oh, they're doing one? Twice. twice. Oh, they said twice. Yeah, one more. Sorry. Yeah. They're Excuse running it twice. Second. That's oh, a... God, there you go. <laughs> you're good. You're good. <clears throat> yep. Mm-hmm. And there's the king. Called it. Chop it up. Double sets. And we're going to chop it up. And we're right back to where we started. Actually, Mahesh had the straight there on the top board. It's funny that we both hit the set <laughs> instead of... <laughs> well, you had a straight. No, I know, but I'm saying... Oh, I know that... you didn't. No, no, I did. <laughs> I had a straight, but I'm saying I hit the set. <laughs> also, set was good anyway by oh, yeah. itself. Yeah, you did with the jack <laughs> so... nine. Yeah, yeah. He needed a jack you then did. seven nine. Yeah. 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 I mean, I straight set. Straight, They're saying, both good. Man, they are both good. Both hit the set, which was good by itself. For somebody so slow, you're pretty oh, you. quick pretty at this like, game. I've played a few hands. I, the, the problem is, is this game gets so out of control so quickly with the betting that you can sit down and flop the nuts, which is almost painful to do in this game. Brittany, this is part and of the And then lose. On the turn and river. And then lose. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Let's go 
going on over here between T1000 and Sweetwacker? Are they digging into the trash? There's a lot of those in this room, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> There's so many of them outside here. This guy goes to Europe, comes back, and he's touching all the tissues in the room. If the whole staff and crew is sick next week, we know who to blame. He was like licking the microphone a couple moments ago too. I mean, wow. What's going on here? Only Big Daddy Chaz would ever do that. He's immune to all types of diseases. Yes. Break this? Yes. Okay. Appreciate y'all tuning in for a special <laughs> episode of the Lodge live stream. A little PLO. We mix it up here on Sundays usually. It's the wild card day. A couple diamonds here. Steve Jones. It's the only possible diamond flush draw. But he's going to lay it down. Broadway for Trust Fund. Seven fifty. Position. Missouri just hoping for a chop. Mazer. Keep calling him Missouri. Yeah. yeah. Are you going to stop doing that? I'm going to try. Mm. He's out of there. Lays it down. Hey, we got a big week coming up. How about starting it off Thursday? Greg Potter, Mike Brady will be in the bunker for this one. Rampage versus Doug Polk. Heads up. Going to start a little earlier than usual. So check your times on Thursday. Could be as early as 1.32 o'clock. Rampage versus Doug Polk. 10.20. Heads up. To kick off a weekend that is gold. We'll tell you more about the rest of the weekend in a little bit. Four twenty in chat on this Sunday afternoon. Spark it. Hiker throwing the party right now. Down heaps. What do you think the largest stack gets to today? I'm going to say over 30,000. How about you? I was thinking about the same. What about over 36,000? I don't know. Depends how long they play. It's a lot with a 2K cap ma uh, yeah. match. Match the stack. Yeah. Uh, hash, come on. You got Everyone a microphone there, Chief. <laughs> Where everyone I has think that's a good one. Nobody has a good one. Any hand that's not good for me. <laughs> King of Hearts puts Mahesh in the lead here. Sweet Wacker's got some possibilities 30 percent equity only one with the flush draw i believe yes <clears throat> dry ace again for mahesh we saw him steal a pot earlier from hiker yeah and he's in there and he's got the best hand the 
ace king. Very unusual for one pair to win. Hiker's going for it. Bet 700. This is probably going to get through. Very rare for one pair to win at PLO. Especially when it's against one of the tighter players. Mahesh is so sticky, though. He's always in there. And he doesn't need much to put his chips over that white line. Hiker may go on tilt if he makes this call. Ah, he's going to make this call. Mahesh isn't folding after he does this chip dance. He's in there. Wow. You got it. Wow. Just a wrap. Ace King. One pair. Wow. Nice. Good call. Nice try there from Hiker. Can't blame him. It's tough to make that call. But one pair is good for a decent sized pot. Hikers at this point thinking, what the hell do I need to do to win a pot? Benny Blanco from the Bronx says PLO is a roller coaster. Yes, it is, especially during the knit game. Robert's unhappy in chat. I mean, we stream No Limit Hold'em 98% of the time. So relax, <laughs> buddy. We appreciate it, Robert. <laughs> Thanks for the comment. You could move on today if you're uh, not enjoying yourself. Coffee. No, just a black coffee. Clown. <laughs> Was that a 50? So it was 825. Mazer with the flush draw and two pair. Two, you won, right? Uh, one time. They're going to run it one time, the river. Yeah, so trying to make that work. Oh, King that. gives the check mark to T1000 with two pair aces and nines, and he'll take it down. Yeah. I'm going to invite into the bunker. We're going to wave goodbye to Skull Mike. He's had a tough week, and uh, he's getting ready for next week. The, one of the newest employees here at the lodge, the new cage manager, Jesse Siegel. Jesse! How you doing, Slick Rick? Oh, yeah, I played right. on stream with you. <laughs> that you did. On Monday, and now you're in the bunker yeah. on Sunday. This is my preferred location to be with you. Jesse, the new cage manager coming from Lost Wages, it. Nevada, be where you were doing the like similar the job Aria. where? At Aria. At yeah. Aria. I, I spent about 13 years at Aria, yeah, well, working I, with I, some I, of the best people I'll in the industry, I'll now I'll also I'll working I'll with some of the best people in the industry at the Lodge. Ooh, ooh, nice. So next time you're here at the lodge, yeah. look for the guy who's wearing all lodge logo from hats to underwear to hoodies. He's created his own lodge logo gear. 
I have been told I have a little bit of a merch addiction, but maybe don't look at my underwear. So there you go. Jesse will be joining me for a, a while today. Wait, I just want to say thank you for having me, Rick, by the way. Yeah. It's my greatest honor to be in here with you. It's been a long time dream of mine to be able to do this. Nice. Nice but to see some of our, our Lodge regulars on this stream. Mahesh. Playing a little PLO, 20 hands in, 19 hands in. Samit with a double-suited pair of jacks here. That's a nice-looking hand. Sweetbacker's never seen four cards he doesn't like, but he's going to lay it down. Interesting. Yeah, that hand had a little potential for someone who likes all four cards. Four. Four. Steven Jones, suited ace king, raises to 625. Sumit, of course, is going to come along. Back to Mazer. We'll fold. And our man, Hiker. Looking very dapper in that Texas jacket. I like it. Hiker, Hiker is throwing the party right now. Is he? So we need, we, Chat, Chatsville loves Hiker. So they're hoping he can win a pot here. Couple clubs for Sumit. Yeah, I don't know if this is going to be that pot. Hiker does have a gut shot. <clears throat> but Sumit's going to put it all in. And that should shut it down. Yeah, not much else out there for anyone. And Sumit is going to get rid of his, if he shows. Let's see if he shows. It looks like he might be about to forget. And, and then it was? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he ah, he remembered. Or got your ass. Kind of. <laughs> he, he asked. That yeah, I asked. I mean, he also yeah, moved. Yeah, he that is, uh, I think it's fine. He, so I show my hand. He was obviously going to show anyway, so I think yeah. it's. But of course, yeah. he asked you about the rules. <laughs> all right, so, so he gets. Yes, yes, that's a, a rule. You have to show. <laughs> unless you... Yeah. You can't tell him to show, though. He's not telling you to show. The rule was if, if, he, if, he, if he, he, has he has to show. If you have to show, show we can't tell, tell you to show. Yeah, no, 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 what I, was your hand? I was it Was it good? I mean, you have yeah, to be aware I, by the way, am a victim of not showing my hand during the knit game on stream. You were, and you also cost me about $400. This isn't the first time he's reminded me of this, by the way. In your haste to turn over your cards in an all-in I, I did call situation. What Rick is saying is factual. I, I did, in fact, make for, the rookie mistake. For, for a man who's worked in the casino industry for 13 years. More than that. More than that. Not to dig my hole any You're deeper. You're just but, digging you know. yourself more. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, so, it's all good. Three players still with their knit button. Oh, man. I don't know that I've seen a PLO knit game before now that I'm thinking Yeah, we, we weren't going to play it, but the players <laughs> wanted to try it and see. It's not like PLO needs more incentive for action. Hmm. We've seen probably 40% of the hands are going all in. I even remember. I, I'm not going to say anything. Then he asked. I said, okay. No, I remember that, and I just I was waiting for him to fold, and then he grabbed his knit button, so he knew what it was. Hello, <laughs> Peter Marshall. Glad to have everybody here. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> Sweet whacker <laughs> with two pair. Folding all the way around to some meat and sweet whacker. Going to take that down. Go. You don't Maybe. have a net button. <laughs> <laughs> he had to think about that for a second. Do I have a net button? Okay, exactly. Here Here's the 50. Here's the 100. As he reaches into the muck and tries to grab it out. <laughs> yeah, we think the knit tax today is $50 per player. That'll be what's paid. Slick Rick along with Jesse, the cage manager. And I always... 
make fun of every time I go to the cage and Jordan is there, your assistant. She's I, not I, my assistant. She's just the assistant. The assistant. Yes, right. The assistant cage manager. I <laughs> slap the, the desk and I say, I demand to speak to the assistant cage manager. <laughs> I call her the ACM. <laughs> She, Jordan does a great job. Shout yeah, out to Jordan if yeah. she hears this, by the way. Yeah, she's. we love Jordan. Used to be a, a game host for the stream. Yeah. She Still does one it of on the original. On occasion, you know, if we need to fill in. Yeah. Oh, Mahesh in there with a double suited aces. Did he open? Check. Looks like Mahesh... With his aces, nobody with a 10 in their hand, so aces are prevailing right now. Amazing. Aces could be the best hand with that many players. Look at the 10 deuce for Doyle out there. Exactly. Club draw possibilities now for Steven. Jack high in a paired board, probably not going to love it even if he gets there. And there's the flush for the runner-up to the main event, World Series of Poker this year. Stephen Jones took home about $6 million. Finishing second to Dan Weinman. Dan Weinman was also here at the Lodge few weeks ago we had him didn't play on stream but we talked with him in the bunker <clears throat> yeah i didn't get a chance to meet him i i had left before he came in but he seems like a very nice guy maybe one day i'll get to meet him yeah very nice down-to-earth guy dan uh knit game was just uh Everybody gets a knit button. You've got to win the hand. Show your winning hand. You can release the knit button. Last person with the button in front of them pays everyone else $50. It's just kind of a game within a game that we play here at the Lodge on the stream. I don't know. ACL, if you want to be the assistant to the assistant, yeah. you're going to have to talk to Jordan. She, she's in charge of hiring for that position. Dwight Trout of the Lodge, mm -hmm. the assistant to the assistant. <laughs> you, must lot, you must watch the office. Yes. <laughs> 300. Okay, okay. Mazer races to 300. Sweet Hiker. Whacker and Hiker in there as well. Yeah, Hiker with the dry ace of clubs. No clubs here. One to worry about. The three of clubs. Looks like pot. Mazer hits a king here. And leading out for pot, sounds like. An aggressive bet with one pair. Nine, nine. I guess he has the gutter ball as well. What's the four? Yeah, what was the, king. the king. king. There's a king hiding in there. So. Lots going on at the lodge. We told you about Rampage on Thursday. Heads up with Doug Polk. How about this one? A week uh, next Saturday. Huge high stakes game. Terrace back. Here in the studio, under the lights, oh, Rampage, Mariano, Doug Polk, <laughs> British Bulldog. You're not going to want to miss that one. <laughs> Saturday. He suggested it. Yeah, that's, that's a my week from yesterday. I lose it. Seems like our <laughs> knit game has ended, and it looks like Hiker was the unfortunate soul to lose the yeah. knit game. Hiker now throwing the party down 7,600. But it's a great party. It's almost a small wedding with an open bar. Ah, for 7600 you can get the wedding, but you're not getting an open bar. <laughs> it's a cash bar. Getting close, though. <clears throat> what? There we go. A nice-looking hand for Hiker. Maybe we can get some momentum going now. Appreciate it. Steven also with a nice-looking hand. He's going to give him a little pushback. Sweet Whacker, a pair of jacks, a couple hearts, <clears throat> and looks like we'll go to the flop. How about this for Hiker? 
Both he and Stephen Jones flop trips. Speedwhacker in there with a flush draw as well. So everybody has a little something something on this flop. Should see some interesting developments. Interesting, Stephen coming in with the raise here. Seems like it would hard to be called by a worse hand. You ace king? Yeah. Me too. Both you players are team. gonna show their ace king. Notice Hiker slightly ahead percentage wise. As he's got a queen there. <laughs> Watch this magic. We both got a You got two live cards, I got one live card. What do you have queen ten? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We both have two live cards. Never mind. There. They're gonna run it one time. Yes. Max Hiker man. needs this. Can Hiker find a queen or a ten? There's Ooh. the queen! And Hiker! Chatsville goes crazy. As Hiker was down 7,600, gets about 2,500 of it back. Wearing a bowl of tie like that, he deserves a nice victory. Oh. Almost worked. And Yoda <laughs> is going crazy out there in Chatsville, really cheering for Hiker. Okay. Yeah, because I want Hiker's where it has like his special Yoda on top of a VW bug for our Other than that, two moderators. Ah, winning a pot he did. Was better than yours was better than mine. There's the V-pips. Look at Sweetwacker. 78%. Usually the loser of the knit game wins the next hand. It's kind, oh, yeah. kind of a I wonder if this is a function of PLO, but the, the, sm the lowest VPIP is about double what most uh, people would say is a skilled way to play. Yeah. Um, Definitely PLO. You're going to be seeing lots of flops. I like the T1000, a little Terminator. Nice hard. I was hoping you had aces. The only time I've had aces so Quick far shout out to Lisa, the dealer, dealer right now. I worked with her 15 <laughs> years ago in Las Vegas at Mandalay Bay. OG Lisa has dealt to three. many famous poker players in yeah. her One of them was career. Three, so still played the hand. Oh, but yeah. A lot of blockers. All spades on this flop. And T1000 with the dry ace. Let's see if he makes a play for this. So what Missouri's going to gonna stick around with his top set for sure. Got deeper and deeper into that thing. Going to be tough to get All paid good. off unless yeah. T1000 Able does the nut blocker or bluff. Or no. Lots of melatonin. Kind of setting up for that out. situation right now. Uppers and downers and <laughs> every day. Just Yeah, it was, it was hard to sleep. Here he is representing that nut flush. No, at the end, I got really sick. Mm -hmm. Actually, we had like one day off at the end. Mm -hmm. Really like to Which see if the like board doesn't pair. What happens? The whole day, just like my body was just shut down. Uh, it was just, just physically. Check mark from Acer. <clears throat> Going for so essentially a full pot. First day of the final table, I was like, just it's like, gonna be like, tough. Macer with huge, just yeah, top set, yeah, he's I'll gonna throw it away. Wow, discipline lay down. Dry ace. Yes. Wasn't really the run out or the flop I needed. All that. Gotta wonder it's if he expects T1000 to be value betting straights there. Because if he doesn't, then it's either fl nut flush yeah, or flush essentially nothing. So I'm surprised he didn't put a little more thought into making a call there. A Not that I would have, but. Right. Yeah. Cool. Justin tuning in saying, What the hell kind of poker is this? Why is everyone getting four starting cards? Well, Every now and then we mix in a PLO stream. PLO, you get four cards. You have to play two and only two from your hand, three on the board, to make your best hand. All right, this is this is cool. Whereas in Hold'em, you don't even have to play any cards in your hand. You can play the board. Not in PLO. Got to play two and only two from your hand. We tried to make a deal. We did. We couldn't make a deal. Yeah, it kind of got all. So we do this every once in a while. Did it, Probably 90% of our between you three or were, did, streams yeah, are did your cash, no limit, hold them, 5% maybe tournaments, um, yeah, or it a was couple percent about, maybe yeah, heads up, and then the other final out. couple percent so would be, be PLO. Third because it was like, 
was a, a, jump. It was a big jump. Yeah, the pay jumps were retarded. Right? Yeah. That's why we wanted to do it, but. Well, six. Four. Yeah, those were ridiculous. And then we were going to do it heads up. Jump. They both wanted to do it heads up, oh. but once he went and had all the chips, he's like, I got all the chips now. I'm like, fuck you, man. <laughs> like, come on. I should, the, I should have tried harder. But like, what was just, the, just, like, the heads up match? Six million? Yeah. Six million dollar heads up. Yeah, and he had me like almost like two and a half, two and a half to one or two and a half. I like those orange oh. and blue sunglasses he's rocking over there. I'm a man of many sunglasses. I've bought like 20 pairs in the last month. A couple clubs from Mazer here. And also Steven. Steven with the nut flush draw. This is where you get in trouble having the king high flush. Yeah. The overpair in the, the King High Flush Row is very tempting, but in PLO, it's not nearly as strong as it seems. Hiker has a set of nines. Makes the call. Even raised with his combo draws. Yeah, he's got a wrap there, six, seven, eight. Any six, seven, or eight will give him a straight. And there's the all-in moment for Mazer. Hiker, middle set. Tough spot for Mazer, but I think he may be overvaluing his hand a little bit. Yeah, all in. Makes the call. Actually, he goes all in. Whatever you guys want to do. I'm always not preferred just once. Once is good. And Stephen Jones. So another big hand Bruin on hand number 25. That's, that's better than even Pachet Queens. <laughs> I hope so. I mean, that's better than Pachet Queens. Aces. Yeah. No, I got set of nines. Ah, yeah, yeah. I didn't need both y'all calls. I'm fucking in trouble right now. Oh, three clubs, man. Fuck. <laughs> Not many clubs available. Who had the most? Three, four, two, six. You, you clubs in between. Well, I, I mean, yeah, I mean, I mean, you see the equities. Obviously, hiker, fifty-two percent to win. But Steven with the wrap, yeah, and the nut flush draw, little combo draw for Steven. You sure you only want one? Fortunately for Mazer, no one's got a ten jack in their hand, so his king is still alive. And he has the king of clubs in his hand, so both of his kings are still alive. No, I'm still pretty. Uh, you have one seven, but yeah. So 14,525 for the main pot. And then this is our side. And then there's a small side pot. Mm. That's sexy, too. Between Mazer and Steven. With these cards, but. Yeah, no, it's a, yeah, 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 now 50 50. Still king. Hurt everybody's feelings. As long as it's followed by an eight. <gasps> Of clubs too, just for just for fun. Can I run it one time? Love Max Payne. <clears throat> I like that card. Well, oh, that's man. not a good fun that, card. That, that <laughs> is, that is. King only, King Lisa. Oh. I, he was winning that pot. And there's the boat <laughs> for Hiker. Hi, boy. And all of a sudden, Hiker. And Mazer is done. Nice hand. I don't know. Yeah, beat this guy. Uh -huh. Nice hand. Appreciate it. Hate to see uh, Mazer go, but we got to like be happy for Hiker finally turning it around, getting some there. positive momentum. Well, he was Maybe down 7,600, and now he's probably in the green. Yeah, I sure. guess it's not his party anymore. How much is it? Somebody else's party. Oh, that she got it already. It, he's got like 15K. Well, I'll lose the Nick game if I follow it up with that. <laughs> yeah. You got to suggest it first, though. Yeah. All right. I'll Nick suggest game. The yeah. lose. <laughs> Hiker, the king of bad jokes. <laughs> and my good friend, our good friend, loves this place. Found the stream about six months ago and has been a regular in the stream chat and has been on stream a couple times. I just added twenty sending one right now. We can wait for the Nick game if they're. We can wait a couple minutes. Are they going to fill the seats pretty quickly? Yeah, I, mean, I, I, yeah. I need to bring out another Nick game already. Right, these guys are. are they want really to go love after it. it. If somebody's coming, I just added twelve five. Nice or two way. Twelve five. 
So match the stack, Stephen Jones. Seat five is going to add twelve thousand five hundred onto his stack. Well, my boy knows him pretty well. I mean, I know him. I know him now. But... Yeah, because I saw I saw you talking to him. Uh, yeah, my one of my friends is uh, good good buddies with him. So yeah, I mean, I did hire him too, though. <laughs> uh, I didn't look yet. Can I still? Straddle to 50 from Steven. Look at that hat from Trust Fund Matt. Old school. That is an original hat right there. That is a good looking Lodge Livestream hat. Is that picture of you drawn to scale? <laughs> Hold on, yeah. You and Skull. Very nice of Skull to let me take his seat for a little while today. Call Mike chiming in. <laughs> he wants his taco bet to to show that he won the knit game that we bet. We bet each other who's going to lose the knit game. Okay, Skull, you got it. A little top set action for Summit right now. but Flush for T-Fund. Coordinated board out there. Summit with the top set. Bet's 300. T-Fun with the 10 high flush going nowhere makes the call. My apologies, Sumit. Yeah. Didn't mean to mispronounce your name there. <coughs> so still, I still had it on the right, though. That's 10. Check mark for T-Fun. 14. See how good, feel, how good he feels about the 10 high flush. Yeah, it's perfect. The first tournament I ever played was... 500 and some odd people in the $500 tournament, but I came in second and just very similar hand to the hand we had a that, little while ago where that guy folded the top set very quickly with the flush on the board. Wow, the first live tournament. And this guy folded it as well, too. Man, this game's I easy. would have had to make a fine <laughs> call. <laughs> Samit wins with top set. Michael O'Shea says, found the stream by accident. I was watching Hustler Casino. I have two people. Then this popped up, and watched this ever since. Uh, I found it. Well, Michael O'Shea. <laughs> nice to have you. We appreciate that. Glad to have you as part of the member of Chatsville. Residents of Chatsville are good folks. I would vote for the random guy. Short hair? Yeah. Skull Mike. I don't know. Yeah, pretty good. Okay. I gotta take off, guys. So I'm gonna fill a seat, and then you guys keep doing what you're doing. Have a good one, Mike. All right, Peace Mike. Thanks, Mike. Thank nice meeting you. Right. Yeah. Nice back. Yeah. Did I make a bad I fold? Bad. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. Bad fold. Will do. I'll talk to you soon, I don't man. I think so. Mahesh doing a little bit of a wide limp here. Yeah. It's interesting that Trust Fund Matt made the call on the turn with the flush, but didn't make the call when the board wasn't paired on the river. So a little curious about that. T-1000 in there with some aces. No suits, though. Not a whole lot on that board nope. for anyone. Nobody with the heart draw. Nobody has hearts. Mahesh got now has trips. And with the board pairings, unlikely Swedwacker will use his ace of hearts to his advantage. Is it not? Interesting call from T1000 there. Seems like that might be a little optimistic. Even in Hold'em, that would be a little optimistic. Hearts get there. Nobody has them. Mahesh's trips have the check mark. King five. Okay. And it goes check, check. King five is going to win this pot. <clears throat> Dan says, I found the Lodge games after I witnessed... You mean the jack four hand on Hustler? The jack three hand? Or the, you mean, I think you mean the jack four hand, but glad you found us, Dan. Started with 2K, now I'm in for 20. So this game escalates pretty quickly. Yeah. 
right here. At first I was like, no, oh, it's going to be a... Lisa, be a you missed one. Oh. I didn't look. Where nobody nobody looked. Yeah. Nobody looked. Well, I don't know about... They get confused in the it, stream. Yeah, yeah, I don't know. But <laughs> that's all. <laughs> that's the only reason. Otherwise, yeah. Sumit coming back in to the studio. Slick Rick along with the cage man. I wonder if I picked it up. The cage manager. Newly hired cage manager. How long have you been here now? Six months. No way. Six months. Six months? I started at the end of March. Six months. That means... I'm not even the new guy anymore. I'm just the guy. So it's been 180 days in a row that you've asked me to come be a commentator on the stream. Let me check the math on that. <laughs> Carry the one. Yes, yes, yes. I just wanted to be able to hang out with you in the bunker, Rick. <laughs> Heads up, T Fun and Steven. Steven gonna lead out with a hundred. Club draw for Steven now. And for T Fund. This is gonna get it done. Not much going on for Steven. Pair of eights. Small clubs. Seems like he's thinking about something, though. Going to make the call. wonder if he has intentions of bluffing. <laughs> Not the best card for either one of them. Let's see who has... This may go check down. Although T Fun. Matt thinks the only way he can win at this point is to bluff with the best hand. Yeah. And that's what he's going to try to do, betting 700. If somehow Steven find, finds a call, T-Fun's going to look like a hero. Guess not. So Matt thinks he just bluffed there, but he bluffed with the best hand. That happens now and then. And once again, one pair. That last 350 was a donation. Wins a PLO <laughs> pot. Did you have clubs at all? I did. I was dead. I think Steven's going to try no. and use that last no. hand as a tax write off I the end of the year. Clubs. I had five high clubs. <laughs> oh, man. There's the lodge <laughs> cam. Look at all those smiling faces. My terrible call. <laughs> yeah, and then I was just blasting. I might go play I thought there was after the stream tonight. It was good. Little yeah. cash <laughs> tables up front. With the best Tournament okay, tables in the back yeah. of the house. I only could have rebluffed. Always a great time here at the Lodge Mahal. That's right. I was thinking about sitting down after I jump off the stream later. Jesse, you're surprisingly a very good poker player. You've won a few tournaments or cashed in several of them here in your six months. Thank you. But let, let's not forget, I chopped with Andrew Nimi the, the PLO tournament during our last series, during the Mayhem series. There you go. Yeah, me and Andrew, although Andrew won the flip for the trophy. So, you know, good for him. Well, you know, I'm, I'm 0 for 3 with trophy flips. If you're going to lose a flip, you want to lose it to one of the owners of the lodge. Yeah. Cowboys for Hiker here. Pair and a gutter ball for T Fund. Hiker picks up a heart draw now on the turn. Check, check, interesting. Check mark for Hiker. And once again, one pair. Tough to value that one pair in PLO, though, so it's probably going to go check, check. It did. Michael Shea says, only the people winning are smiling. Now, I think everybody smiles here at the Lodge. They may not outwardly be smiling, but inside they're saying, would I rather be here or doing housework or be at work or be anywhere else? Would I rather be at the Lodge? Yes, that's why I say, I always say, look at all those smiling faces. Because I know deep in their heart, they're so happy to be here. Just I can tell you this, in six months, I haven't worked a single day. <laughs> Some wow. might disagree with that, but yeah, I think there's, I there's nothing I enjoy more than being at the Lodge, so wow. I have not worked a single day. I don't ever remember being in a game with him. I don't think I have. have. Is there card rooms out there? <laughs> no. Just private games? Yeah, they, yeah. they had a uh, call. 
He's he was a nice guy for they sure. They had a quasi legal win for a while. That yeah, but in all down. seriousness, if life goes according to plan, I will donating their money. He's spending a long, long time working for the lodge. Yeah, that happens a lot. That happened in uh, I played a lot of games back in the day in Michigan. They did that charity games, the only way to make it legal and stuff, and then. Mm -hmm. waiting for the graphics to get set. We are getting someone to fill the empty seat that Mazer left us with. I noticed Hiker has repositioned Yoda to the other side of his chip stack. <laughs> Mahesh flopping the Nutter Butters. Yeah, Broadway with a nut flush draw to boot. This is one of those classic situations. Oh, well, Mahesh also has a nut flush draw, so he's going to be yeah. more than happy to bloat this pot. Yeah. But too often you see p people who are new to PLO, they flop the nut straight with no backup draws or anything, and they end up getting free rolled in big pots. But Mahesh has no fears in this hand. T-1000 with two pair. Backdoor diamonds that are no good. Hiker, well, now they are. Hiker will fold and get out of the way. Mahesh and T-1000. And there's those backdoor diamonds. Deuce of diamonds comes. But Mahesh... says pot... It's 1580. T-1000 now with two pair and a flush draw. Amazingly, he's up against the nut straight and the nut flush draw, and he still has 30% equity in this hand. Going to make the call. And we will go to a river. T-1000 looking for a king jack or diamond. Does not come. Mahesh with Broadway. The nuts. How you doing? Hello, just Good. I'm Kerry. Nader, nice to meet you. Nader? Looks like Mahesh is going with a more value size bet. 1300 About 30-ish percent pot. 33 percent-ish. T-1000 getting a really good price here, but in PLO, it's tough to make this call with two pair with the way Mahesh has played this pot. Nice hand, Mahesh. Nice fold. Too. Oh, beautiful turn and river for you, Mahesh. Two and five. <laughs> you mind if I buy some nice. from you? Sure. sure. Thank you. You bet. So is Mama 1000 watching today? Every day. <laughs> yeah. What's the time like right now? Uh, Mama 1000, be very proud of that fold. Since Sarah been, Grotick so is the mother was, of T-1000. Like Doesn't miss a stream he's on. So, uh, 4,000. Do you know the knit game rules if we play the knit game again? Uh, I don't know. So everybody at the table gets a knit button. If you win a hand, you have to show your cards to release your button. The last person that has the button left pays $50 to everybody, including the dealer. So just, just make sure you remember to show your cards. <sighs> How are you? Good, man. Good, good. New player to the table. We'll get his name here in a second. Also, we should put on next, so give good action. 
<laughs> you don't like me calling with like 10 7 3 D? <laughs> T1000, a suited ace. Are you? I'm good, man. And some I'm snowman. Uh, just a little bit, man. Like four hours. I slept one. <laughs> uh, check. Six ways to a flop. Just like the last time, there was two tens on the flop. Nobody has a ten in a six-way pot. <laughs> Samit's nines are going to be in the lead here. And everybody's folding. What's, what's your name, Leo? Uh, Nader. Defund makes the bet. Neither. With a two pair, tens and threes. We'll take it down. Uh, Nick came. So this is five. All right. Yeah. yeah. So our second knit game of the day, they were waiting for that seat to be filled. You know how it works, folks. Everybody gets a red knit button, put it in front of them. Win a hand, you must show the winning hand to release the knit button back to the dealer. And the, dealer the last person with the their option. knit oh, button yeah. in front of them uh, will pay $50 to every other player. Left, uh, and it looks yeah. like the new player in seat three, uh, the battle Dr. Lawyer. Stephen Jones is throwing the party now. Yeah, Stephen Jones now down 66. And Shul, no, we do not play double board bomb pots on the stream. Now, in the main room, every dealer change, every holder hold em game in the joint, as long as it's a cash game, we'll play a double board bomb pot PLO every dealer change. So if you like the double board bomb pots, the lodge is your place. Come on down, we'll play some double board bomb pots together. A nice looking hand for Sumit. Ace Ace Queen Jack double suited. Raising it up to 900. Cool. It's going to be tough to get too much action. None of these are particularly enticing hands. Steiner is not a PLO player. I tried try to get him. Try to get him. He wouldn't do it. Yeah, he's only played a couple. If he just wear the cowboy hat. Yeah, I think he's T-Fun's going to defend. Yeah, right. Yeah, he played. We played in Ace is still game. good for some meat. He didn't, do, he didn't do too bad. But Double suited ace, always a good <laughs> starting in like, uh, PLO. PLO going to fire out 400. Just a gutter ball for T-Fun, so not a lot going on. The knit button, though, he's incentivized to continue. on picking up a club draw, but otherwise that's a brick. T-Fun gets there with the clubs, backdoor style. So if you brought the 10K, you're playing the main then, right? Yeah, definitely. Just <laughs> go ahead and buy my ticket Just buy it on the way yeah. out the door. Oh, thank you. Appreciate it. So me going to lead out. Interesting decision. That's the aces. Flush. Flush. Let's go ahead and hear... From our stream sponsor, Upswing Poker. What's up, guys? Doug Polk here with a quick story for you. Seven years ago, I founded Upswing Poker to create the best training course material out there. The result was the Upswing Lab. Unlike other subscription poker courses, the lab teaches you step-by-step step how to become the best player at the table. When you join the lab, you don't just get thrown into a sea of videos. Instead, you get structured lessons that teach you crucial poker strategies that will help you win in No Limit Hold'em games, whether it's cash games or tournaments, both online and live. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced poker player, the lab has what you need to take your game to the next level. As a Lodge viewer, you can get $50 off the Upswing Lab with coupon code LODGE50. The course is backed by Upswing Poker's all-in 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk on your end to join the lab. If you're serious about improving your game, head on over now to upswingpoker.com, join the lab, and use coupon code LODGE50 to save $50 now. Looking forward to seeing you guys in the lab.
rounds off. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Doug. Get $50 off with code LODGE50 to the Upswing Lab Training Course and Community. So we see our next hand here. T1000 raises to 800 pre-flop. Even with a nice looking hand. Oh, I thought that was double suited. It's not. Slightly less good looking. I'll take Hiker's hand. 6543, the rundown, double suited. And so Hiker now has a wrap. Hot. And bottom pair. Look at Tifon, though, top set. This is going to be an interesting hand. T fund all in for seven thousand. T one thousand finds himself with two pair himself. Yeah, yeah. Almost exactly. He should be able to find a fold here with bottom two pair. There's thirty two. No. This is 3250, right? You said 3250. Yeah. Even if bottom two pair was the best hand, you wouldn't be much of a favorite. <clears throat> Rightly lays that one down. Back to Hiker with the wrap. He's going to lay it down. Nice. Cool. And a okay. quick call from Stephen Jones. No diamonds. Please, Diamond. <laughs> with the nut uh, yeah. flush draw. Oh, or six. Six would be nice. And straight possibilities. Nice little $17,000 pot. One of the biggest pots of the day. And not a lot of like Stevens outs were, were up, nice. so it seems to be drawing pretty live. Hard for the board to pair. Looks like they're doing one time. Oh, boy. Oh, I almost had two clubs. Club. Not nah, diamond. Ooh. Six works. Six, Six works. Could have done twice. <laughs> and he gets there. <laughs> Always one. <once. laughs> yeah, that's fair. You, have been, you have been consistent. Steven Jones taps T-Fund on the shoulder and says, no, and gonna be a really Should have gone twice, yeah, brah. Now you're still going to go. And he gets rid of his uh, nit button I had if he had one. Oh. Was it a six of clubs on the river? No. No. Nope. Don't feel bad, T-Fund. I like one time. Thank you. So if you haven't guessed it, 33 hands in, PLO, drawing game, PLO, roller coaster game, you could be throwing the party one minute, and the next hand, you could be the big winner. That's right. Many 1-2-0 uh, no limit games players have gotten unstuck with their bomb pots. 50, yeah. Here. You want more, too? You want more? Uh, you want yeah. more greens? I'll take five green, five black. Mesh with I'll the this, slightly better looking version yeah, of the hand that Steven just had. Thanks. Yep. Actually double suited. with a nice looking hand, although I wouldn't like it if that six of diamonds was the six of spades. The hikers got that covered, so. This is a, okay, so that's a, that's a limp. Yeah, so. Hot. What is it? Is that just a steam raise because you can't lose the knit game? Yeah. <laughs> I was, oh, it took me a it. second to figure out what you meant by that. <laughs> well, now, how do I win this one? Four ways to a flop. 
Skittles, Jack okay. for three. I was trying to test Queens for hiker. Out in front. <clears throat> in the middle of yet another nit game. There what you see card. the straight for some meat. With the nut flush redraw. That was a, what would they call a magic card for some meat. Unfortunately for him, no one else really has too much. So Meat's going to put it all in there. And just over to Mahesh. Mahesh lets it go. No fuss. All right. Sumit, no doubt. Sumit a little disappointed. will show his winning hand to get rid of his knit button. Oh, what a bad what thing. Turn turn. Oh, my God. What not a not. Turn card. Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> Mahesh liked that turn card. <laughs> That's why I said it's the magic turn card. That Gives should actually add another knit card to that. <laughs> <laughs> That's like a real knit. <laughs> yeah, you should be able to lose Everybody it. check, check, check. No bet, no call, man. We had anything. So many available variations on the knit game. Michael, you asked what is the best starting hand in PLO, ace, ace, king, king, double suited. Some would believe that. Some would also believe ace, ace, jack, ten, double suited. Some might even I say, like, <laughs> ace, ace, king, queen, double suited. There's a lot yeah, of uh, different opinions. I personally would take ace, ace, jack, ten, double suited. I have only one time in my life been dealt ace, ace, king, king, double suited. I took a picture of it playing online. There's the raise from Trust Fund Matt. Get a three bet to 700. Swedewacker is coming along. Swedewacker feeling a little optimistic. All hearts on this flop. T Fund with the only heart in his hand. <clears throat> Sweet Racker fires out and a quick call. Fourth heart on the board. Two pair for T Fun. And he's got the check mark. But there's Broadway cards out there, flush draw out there, and he's got two pair. So he'll check and we'll take this pot down. Coming around the corner in November, next month, November 26th through December the 3rd, $500,000 main event for our winter tournament series, which starts Black Friday, the day after Thanksgiving. $500 buy-in, $500,000 guarantee. Get to the lodge. You only play PLO? I plan on firing a couple of bullets in that. Hope to see you guys down there with me. You're home of great tournaments, at least four tournaments every single day. I like a good PLO. I, feel like a PLO I have a feeling that one's going to go way over the 500,000. Yeah. It's going to be quite the turnout. Maybe we'll play some more PLO in the future. Hopefully. 1,000 opening to 100. Always pair of kings for rainbow. It is. Stream, yeah. But well, maybe I'll play some regular PLO out here next time I come. Dr. Lawyer choosing to three bet to with the rundown hand, but it's complete rainbow. To get what going? Interesting decision. Hard to get PLO on the stream. PLO, PLO on the stream. It doesn't happen very frequently, right? It doesn't happen, but it's not hard to. No, yeah. well, because the viewers. No, there are people yeah, interested. We just uh, we just have not, more. <laughs> not very many. Nope. Yeah, not so many people. And watching. it's very difficult for people who do not play PLO to really calculate what's happening <laughs> on the board. It's a good way to learn, though. You can yeah, learn really quick. No, uh, watch yeah. One stream I mean, not many good. people are. I agree. I agree. I Five ways to the fly. PLO, PLO streams, streams. Yeah, but but there aren't too many happening yet. Yeah, okay. How about top set for Steven? 
seems like top set of queens is very common in this game. Yeah, yeah, interesting. You just the don't have the viewership that, that yeah. much, yeah. For, for a stream game, the viewership has to be something. Here's the problem with three betting a hand like 9876 Rainbow. He's now flop bottom two against top set, and he's going to feel like he has a strong hand since he was the initial aggressor. He also does have the open ended straight draw. That's a really bad card for Dr. Lawyer. His, his straights would now be much weaker. There's going to be a chop now as the straight is on. Both players have a straight, the queen high straight. Dr. Lawyer using 8-9. Steven using his queen 10. Both players are playing the same queen high straight. Remember, you must use two and only two from your hand. Sort of a fascinating spot with both players having the same straight with an unplayable straight on the board knowing that ace-king is a really strong hand here. Feel better the longer we're taking. <laughs> <laughs> Both of them could potentially have ace-king in their hand, the way that the hand played out. be interesting to see if Dr. Lear chooses we to bluff raise straight. here since he three-bet pre-flop. Or just a king with a friend. I mean, you just you don't, you don't need, necessarily need the ace-king to... I don't think... A, a raise would be coming with just a king straight. I did straight. not know he had blacks over there. Oh, sorry. Yeah, put those in front, please. I had these way more in a false than that. I, I just saw, I thought he had 15. Yeah, I thought he had 15. I didn't see the wow. all were on the other side of the green. He's going to lay it down. It shows you there how PLO can mess with people's minds a little bit, not realizing that they had the same straight. Oh, my goodness. Uh, I, w I, w I would have bet more on the river. Oh, you would have bet more. Yeah, you yeah. Made more. He like, laid down, I mean, he did not show that his 8-9. Huh? I'm not getting yet. Good, good, good. Yeah, good. maybe it worked out. Yeah. I just didn't see him at all. Pressure mounting on net players. And, and that is uh, <laughs> interesting. Sometimes you your mind you plays tricks on you. You're thinking you need a certain yeah, card, it's, it's the and then when one does, it can't put it all together. By the way... But he made the call, and he, they, he saw the winning hand. Yeah, yeah that's a good point, because if he more. made the call, he had to know what his hand was. Yes. And he saw that the other guy had the same queen high straight, so you got to wonder what thought, his thought process was. I mean, the, and the other... There's always a theory of... Just turn your cards over. Yeah. Because if he just turns his cards over, the dealer will see that he would have tied that hand. Anybody if I'm calling for $1,000, I'm probably just going to turn my cards over regardless. Right. Anybody new to the game, PLO or poker in general, will know that. When you get to showdown, just show your cards. Let the dealer decide if you have the best hand. And Shuraj says, always show the hand in PLO. <laughs> I mean, it happens to anybody. Gets confusing. As he, here we see Swedwacker putting a bunch of banana in play. <coughs> He's going to bet pot after T1000, three bet to 1500. Yeah, Tommy, Tommy says, been there, done that. <laughs> I think we all have. Yeah. I don't, want, I don't want you guys to think that I'm just jumping on him here. I've definitely made that same mistake or similar ones. Sweet Wacker, four bets to 52.25, back on T1000. This is all pre-flop action. You just have to wash on top of it. I bet if you just have the fourth one and you do that, it's not scanning because the three cards, so I, I just like straight Not good. Down. See you later, Bogdan. This is not good. Have a good night, Bogdan. T1000 says, this is not good. Little does T1000 know that he actually hasn't crushed. 
as PLO equities go, this is yeah. about as crushed as you could be. Free flop. Problem is, we most likely have aces. He does not. It would almost feel unfair if someone with a V pip in the 60s or 70s picked up aces. Lays it down. Kings? No, 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 no. I lost this huge. He's no, I, not going to oh, show. He's not going to show. Not going to show. Oh, he does. Oh, he, he does. He does. Okay. Wow. Sweet whacker. Wow. What's a flop? <laughs> Just help yourself. Yeah, you can. I thought I was <laughs> up against aces. Just, just put it out. <laughs> We're interested, too. Can you see this well? That's a good flop. I had a wrap. Yeah. You have a flop. You, you had a big wrap. I had small wrap. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, ace, seven, six, Jack, five. ten, seven, ace. Oh yeah, that thing's not the fun. I highly recommend you yeah. don't do what T1000 <laughs> does at your local yeah, casino no, or no, even no, here no, at the lodge. No, no, no. Stream a little bit more lenient rules for the players, but never reach for the dealer's stub and look for cards. You do that in Las Vegas, you're probably getting 86. Not a good idea. Two suits. Two suits. I thought I was getting aces. Well, yeah, of course. It's a tough one. Yeah, I've only seen Daniel play this today. Well, he put in <laughs> 6,000 free. That's, that's filed under don't try this at home. Hmm. Yeah, I was wrong. Dr. Lawyer, I wonder. I mean, I wonder if he, it, I don't think he even realizes. The hand that he folded, I, I that he would have chopped, yeah, he I will at some point game. today. Still, Somebody's going to let him know. No, I've never for sure. In three days. And his friends are probably not going to let him forget about it for, for a little while. I tried to light twelve thousand. If they're good friends, they need to give him the business. Yeah, the for sure. But it got through. <laughs> Just three it. ways to a flop. Two players with their knit button. You see that by the red dot next to their name. We whacker with top two on that board. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, top two. He went thousand able to make that bet with his two fives as blockers to the straights. There's the call from Dr. Lawyer with the flush draw. He went thousands fives are way in the lead here. T one thousand will take it down. Take it down. Jerome Teal says PLO love it and hate it all at the same time. That eh, PLO players we get at least three to five PLO games every single day here at the Lodge, it seems like. And they love PLO. The PLO players, they sit in their own side of the room. And they have fun. It does seem like we have endless PLO action here. going to open. Mahesh looked with a nice looking hand and the knit button. Double suited jacks for Mahesh. If someone has a pair of queens, we'll probably see a queen high flop. Nope. <laughs> Couple diamonds for Mahesh.
tough spot from Hesh. Typically, he'll be against a ace and a bigger flush draw. There's the wheel for Steven. What's the pot? Matt, have you really only seen me show ace? 18. 18. 1,800. Have you really only so Steven's going to make a pot size bet. <laughs> this should get Mahesh out. <laughs> Mahesh can get sticky, but he's going to fold it. <laughs> Folks, don't forget, coming this week, With two pairs. the heads up open, October 13th through the 15th. Hey, a week from today, we will be streaming, I think, the semifinals and the final table nice of the draw. heads up open. All it is is $1,000 to enter. Once eight players have entered, that'll be a flight. The winner of that flight moves on. You can re-enter once per day. If you get busted, you can try again. $2,000. I think they're capping it at 128 total players. Get over here, October 13th through the 15th. We will stream it. A week from today, yeah. the final table. I think the semifinals and finals. Not a bad turn card for me. I think we still have three knit buttons in play. Some of you out there in chat still may notice some more limping that happens in PLO. Typically, people will limp with hands in PLO they don't want to have to call three bets with. Whereas, had they opened and then been raised, they end up having to fold. By limping, it allows them to call a smaller raise and see the flop. Learned that little bit of piece of information from Dylan Weissman last year. Dr. Lawyer, equity-wise, in the lead here with his flush draw <clears throat> and sevens. Sweet Racker with the jacks. Sweet Racker's going to fold. Dr. Lawyer's going to take it down. ACL Skull. I don't think we ever made a bet on whether Doug would be making the semifinals of the heads up open that will be happening. What do you have, Jet? What do you have? Considering that the man finished second in the WSOP Heads Up Championship, I'm going to say it's pretty good odds that he's going to make it to the semifinals. Oh, no. Yeah. It's not looking good. Oh, no. Well, Jerome, that is not a very nice way to talk about his suit. That is a very Texas-styled Southern suit. Never seen anybody in Texas wear that suit. I agree with Jerome Teal. It's a Pulp Fiction outfit. I love Hiker. But people in Austin don't dress like that. They don't wear bolo ties? Uh, I don't. I, I can't remember the last time I saw a bolo tie. Well, I'm originally a New Yorker, and then I lived in Vegas, so my, my knowledge of Texas fashion apparently is li leaves a little to be desired. That's not terrible. odd score. Huh? That's an odd score. Yeah, I think the, uh, eight to thirteen. The, the Jets got a safety and two field goals. Oh, okay. And the Broncos got two. Big fan of Tarantino, though. Uh, well, I'm, I'm not drunk. Yet. It's, it's about half. It's about half time, so. Maybe, yeah, maybe not quite, but... Yeah, you're not a favorite. Nope. It's not, I'm not doing terrible. Oh, sorry. Steven, with that kind of hand where when you're playing, you peel it, you see one ace, then you see a queen. You're like, all right, this is a good start. Then you see another queen. You're like, this is great. And then you see the third queen, and you're like, ah, oh, come I mean, on. If the Jets win, come on. <laughs> if, if the Jets win, then I don't lose too much. So the the with a nice little hand. Suited that's ace not, with that's kings. That's right, Albert. They do. Don't ever forget it. Definitely not favoring both. <laughs> you missed a chance to go 200. Oh, good. <laughs> Five ways to this oh, flop. This Already 2,000 in the skillet. OG Lisa will give us three.
couple of eights yeah, there. Have to go huh? And the you Cowboys. I did go 100. And did. the flush okay, draw. My bad, my bad. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's why I said he had yeah. a chance to go too. In the lead, little open ender for Sweet Whacker. Yes, my strategy worked again. Ah, man. <laughs> you have a boat, queen's full. <laughs> oh, yeah. full. Yeah, trips in your hand, not a good starting good hand fold, in PLO. The knit again. Mm -hmm. it works, it's my works strategy. Again. Usually you have to pay double. For yeah, for why didn't we, we didn't agree to it though, did we? <laughs> You're lucky we didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Now we have to, we still can't do it though because it's not fair to him. Usually though. Takes a lot of bullets. Let's do let's twice. do a double if he I if did he loses Thursday, we don't do double. Thursday, but Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. 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 last night it was still you know going. What I mean? like, you can just play the next one for a hundred. Uh, clearly I'm a net this weekend. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. I'll make myself a T-shirt for a thousand. So just do that. BW yeah, Bug lets really us really all know yeah, yeah. Nitex has been paid. Big shout out to Yoda and VW Bug. So committed to this stream. Yeah. Such a big part of our fun that we have here. Thank you both. Trust fund Matt, three bets to 2,400. So meet with the pocket kings, double suited. Pocket aces double suited for T Fund. We're just saying what's the best possible starting hand? It's pretty darn close for T Fund. Pretty darn close. Yeah, Four bet from Swedewacker, and an all in from T Fund. Two pair. Oh shit. <laughs> that was zero pair. Swedewacker says, "Oh shit." Oh, wow, that's no, pretty good. Super man, man. <laughs> Swedewacker's gonna show. Oh, He's gonna need a lot of help here. I don't think that's great. Just get all your straight outs. <laughs> it's like, wow, look at that awesome hand for T Fund. Ace, yeah, Ace, Jack, Jack, double suited. We were, yeah, we were just talking about one of the best possible starting hand that's up there. That's definitely a premium. They're going to run it one time. Sweet Whacker needs some help. There's a 10 in the window. How about two of them? But a boat for T Fund. A hidden ace was nice. And T Fun. Thank you. What I saw the two flop. tens first. What He's going to win that hand. Flop. What a flop. Glad I folded double suited kings here. <laughs> you did? How much? Folks. Help me jump out of an airplane. How do we do that? Well, we're at about 144,000 subscribers. Thank you. I made a ridiculous statement last, uh, about six, seven months ago, that if we, when we hit 150,000, I would jump out of an airplane with a parachute. Well, 
We're he getting pretty, so pretty close. All you got to do is subscribe to the channel. We promise we will bring it strong each and every stream. We're on four times a week, 3 p.m. Central, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Personally, I'm very excited to see you jump out of an airplane. With a parachute. So if you haven't uh, subscribed, hit that button now. There is another look at the Lodge Cam. Look at all those smiling faces. Playing a little cash. Most of those tables look to be the one-two tables. Maybe you like the one. In the background, you see coolers, our bar. Free soft drinks, be, uh, water and soft drinks, free to all players. Everything else costs a little bit. They had served snacks, beer, wine. 50, 102, yeah. Probably not going to go. No legs. Might be able to get the four. Why Marinara? Yeah. Wants to know how many without the parachute. Wow. You mean early? That's Jeez. pretty cold. Yeah, why would you wish that on Slick Rick? That's, that's cold. Now, I'd like to see him do it like one of those squirrel suits on or something. That would be it is right? PLO game. One of those Air Bull Red Racers. Or... Suited ace with a pair of aces for Mahesh. Stephen Jones with 40% of Royal Flush. Couple spades for Stephen Jones. Very interesting flop. The flush draw, the hash with the overpair and the king. That card likely not to get anyone too excited. There's the spades. Nutty buddy for Stephen Jones. It's going to be tough for him to get paid here. I like the big bet. Make it look like you're doing the nut flush blocker. Since Mahesh does not have the ace of spades in his hands, he might consider that Stephen could be doing that. Still hard to call with one pair. He did it earlier today against Hiker. Nice but not hope. this time. Albert H wants to see me use a wingsuit out of a plane. You know, that's what I was talking about—the wingsuit. Those wingsuits. I mean, it's like the first guy to do that to get the <laughs> idea. Okay. I'm not going to have a parachute. I'm just going to jump. I'll put some extra material under my armpit, and I think I'll do it. Yeah, I mean, squirrels can do it. Why can't I humans? I mean, the first guy to do that. He had to have been like, all right, listen, if this doesn't work out, I won't be around to know. So, I mean, such is life. I guess it goes back to the first guy who, who ate an egg from a chicken. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of questionable Oh, decisions. yeah, I got to have that. Yeah. Just dropped out of the chicken's yeah. ass. <laughs> <laughs> or the first person to eat a mushroom. Like, look at that yeah. little thing growing on the floor exactly. of the forest. That looks appetizing. Let me eat that. There you go. Trips for Mahesh. Not the best thing in <laughs> PLO. The trips. But Mahesh is feeling a little optimistic, and he's going to play it anyway. Hiker with some aces. Seems like... Every hand, someone has a pair of aces. Just five. Couple hearts. 
for Mahesh. Mahesh is really making lemonade out of those lemons right now, let me tell you. Hiker's sticking around with his aces. I hope he knows that his deuce is a diamond and not a heart. In a position like Mahesh's, when he calls that 250, you have to wonder what card he hopes to hit. He's never going to love hitting a flush. Calling multiple ways in PLO, probably against a bigger flush draw. Interesting decision to fold. Obviously, to me with the super wrap. Yeah, it's obviously the correct decision to fold. But if you were going to call your flush draw multiple ways, now that your head's up, when your flush might actually be good, you think that might be the time you'd want to consider playing it. And then he opted to fold. What do I know? I don't play a lot of pillow. Adding two k. T one thousand. Adding 2,000 to his stack. It is match the stack at any time. You can match the largest stack at the table. Looks like Steven's building a, quite a little castle over there. I only have three cards. Missed, yeah. No action. So one player was only dealt three cards, and because there was no action, yet, they're going to do a miss deal. If I would have looked and you guys let me, I would have done it. <laughs> that would have been fun, actually. We are playing 5, 10, 25 today. We've got a straddle on for T1000. For 50, and we'll try this again. Just skipped you. Yeah. Sorry. At one point. Yeah. Haven't seen any crazy re 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 straddles yet, have we? Which means one of my cards might not have been one of my cards. Not too many. Yeah. Or maybe two. 113 likes. If you're having fun with us today, we do have about 550 people watching right now. Be great if you could hit that thumbs up. It helps spread the word around. And I have always not there. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny, SV Thor. Yeah, we did some crazy stuff as kids. Back when kids played outside. T1000 raises here. The two pair in his hand. Looking to flop a set. Nobody here loving their hand. Mahesh was just now Mahesh is feeling a little bit better about his hand. Still doesn't love it though because he doesn't have any kicker of substance. Trips for Mahesh will make the five hundred dollar bet, half size pot, and he's gonna take it down. Mahesh wearing his standard uniform of the World Series of Poker is this one jacket. Before? Anshul, good question. What would happen if someone gets five cards if there's action already? If there's action already, I believe their hand would be dead. But it would depend on when the, the cards were noticed and how much action had taken place. There's rules on significant action and so on and so forth.
Things happen. We have the best dealers in the country, but even our dealers make any, the occasional mistake. Absolutely. Any human being can make a mistake at any time. Oh, it is 100? Oh, it was the straddle? Yeah. Ah. I just heard call, call. I thought you said call, call. But unlike home games, misdeals are pretty rare in casinos. Once three cards are dealt, there's different rules on how to act, especially if there's significant, if there's significant betting action. Very rarely will they say miss deal, throw all the cards in, whereas in a home game, could happen quite often. Interesting board here with Sumit flopping middle set, but we got T1000's got the open ender, but he's also got sevens blocking his own outs with the, the wrap that he's working with. So not great to chase it. Mahesh with naked bases just folds, of course. That card should pretty much shut the entire hand down. Play the game one. Bring it back. Thanks. Can we do a hundred? Yeah. Looks like the next Nick game they play, they're going to want to play for a hundred dollars okay. per player Nick game tax. They did fifty last two times. Yeah, and we're going to wave goodbye to OG Lisa and say hello to Damon the Tatted One, the hot dog eating wonder. Good job, OG Lisa. While we're waiting for Damon to. Shuffle up. Let's hear from our stream sponsor, Upswing Poker. What's up, guys? Doug Polk here with a quick story for you. Seven years ago, I founded Upswing Poker to create the best training course material out there. The result was the Upswing Lab. Unlike other subscription poker courses, the lab teaches you step by step how to become the best player at the table. When you join the lab, you don't just get thrown into a sea of videos. Instead, you get structured lessons that teach you crucial poker strategies that will help you win in no limit hold'em games, whether it's cash games or tournaments, both online and live. Whether you're a beginner or an advanced poker player, the lab has what you need to take your game to the next level. As a Lodge viewer, you can get $50 off the Upswing Lab with coupon code LODGE50. The course is backed by Upswing Poker's all-in 30-day money-back guarantee, so there's no risk on your end to join the lab. If you're serious about improving your game, head on over now to upswingpoker.com, join the lab, and use coupon code LODGE50 to save $50 now. Looking forward to seeing you guys in the lab. There he is, Doug Polk. He'll be here at the Lodge later this week for Heads Up Thursday. Greg Potter and Mike Brady will be in the bunker commentating their Rampage versus Doug Polk Heads Up match. And then Rampage, Mariano, Doug, all be here on Saturdays with Terrace Rounding up. Uh, and the British Bulldog. Swedewacker coming in here with a hefty raise. Okay. Nice looking hand, especially with, with his V pip. That's definitely towards the top of his range. Mahesh speculating a little bit. You definitely put this one under the questionable side. It's hard to make any real nutted hands with King Jack Nine Deuce. Yeah, it's cold in here. And as I yeah. say that, he flops an open like straight draw to the nuts. Right you feel like front. you're at home. Yeah, I actually, I, I feel cold, and I almost never feel cold. <laughs> but uh, it's a nice feeling. <laughs> it's refreshing. <laughs> Rap here from Mahesh. Any nine jack Alex king Alex gets him home. Cold. Yes, sir, and he was sitting here. It's way colder here than on that. 
Uh, check. Hiker turns the set and will make the bet. 1300 I'm wearing three layers, so I'm pretty comfortable. I wouldn't. I'd be freezing. I like your, what's that called, bolo tie, right? Yes. Very cool. Thank you. There was no sarcasm in his compliment to that bolo tie, by the way. Is, that a, is it a Texas thing or is it a, like American thing? I think it's just like a cowboy thing, so probably more Texan than anything. My man hiker. The hash getting there. The hash gets there with his rap. Mahesh has, knows how to make a nut straight. He, he definitely knows how to do that. All right, so Mahesh, I told you I watched you on stream when you went deep in the tournament. I promised myself if I got in a hand with you, I know you're good at reading people, so I would need to put my glasses on, so let me do that. Oh. <laughs> Hiker. Waited for that moment all stream long. That was just my joke about flipping the table off because he did that in his stream. Hiker, don't explain your stuff. jokes. That's where you go wrong. If you have to explain it, it loses everything. <laughs> I'm going to have to talk with Hiker. Yeah. All right, I'll pay you off. And he's going to make the call and see the bad news. I got it. Mahesh shows him the nut straight. And we'll collect $9,000. And let's look at a slow-mo of Hiker. Let's look at him do his best Mahesh routine. Look at his middle finger. Yep. There you go. Hiker. I didn't see that. They had, they had just started doing the slow-mo. I like those glasses, though. They match his Yoda. And Mahesh was in a hand and had to adjust his glasses, and that's how he did it. And they brought it into slow motion. <laughs> the middle finger. So it's, like, it's like the classic clip now. Mahesh knows the, the future. Channel. He knows the future. He knows what's coming. <laughs> no, my, my was... Wine says, LMAO, <laughs> these games are so <laughs> soft. <laughs> hey, Lodge is open 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We invite you, Wines. Yeah. Come on to these soft games. We'd love to have you. And if you want to play on stream, we'll tell you all about that after this hand. Joey Ingram, the man himself, Joey Jackets. I knew he would put a PLO stream out there. Joey Ingram will come. You like that slow-mo replay we got? Wines wants to come to the soft games here at the Lodge Mahal. Mahesh with that classic example of a hand that you'd want to limp and not raise because you don't want to face a three bet. And it shows you now he's able to make that easier call of 200. Dr. Lur is speculating with a mediocre hand. Couple nines here. The jacks for Mahesh. Out in front. Flush draw for Sweetwacker. But when that board pairs, the flush draws aren't nearly as attractive. Dr. Lawyer will take it down. Hey, you want to play on the Lodge live stream? Here's how you do it. Go to the Lodge live stream, uh, the lodgepokerclub.com slash live stream on our website, fill out the questionnaire, or contact Skull Mike directly on his Instagram or Twitter, at Skull Mike Poker. Tell him, Dear Skull Mike, the games of the Lodge are soft. I want to come crush on the stream. Please get me in. Now, just start the conversation. Let us know when you're coming to town. Skull Mike does a fabulous job at getting people into the stream. And we've got some seating openings later this month and into November. So now is a good time. 
And if you need to wire money in, I'm happy to help you, you do it. You guys weren't doing like 2 4, and then it was me, and then I would have to put, put eight. You're all in, there. Steven. Well, welcome back. <laughs> Jesse the cage manager. That's right. Cage man poker. Shuts up. 15 30. Wines, you want to come out here and show us how soft these games are? I'll help you wire the money in. Although, as long as, you currently, know, we're not doing international wires we'll if you're from Australia. You still have a chance to win both. I do. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's the beginning of third, so yeah. I still need the Denver yeah, to just. I think Jets might have got to pick six because it happened quickly. <laughs> Stephen Jones, once again, finished second Thank in the World Series of Poker main event. Took home over $6 million, losing to Mr. Weinman, who was a guest here in the bunker a few weeks ago. He just stopped in. Said hello. How about a set here for Dr. Lawyer? We got a little straight draw action for T1000. Sweet Whacker in there with a good hold'em hand, not so great PLO hand. Pot size bet here. T1000. With the wrap, 789. And there's the all in moment from Dr. Lawyer. And he and T1000. Okay. T1000 asking for the count. It's tough to call off with here, but. You know. If you're going to play that hand, you can't really fold when you have a wrap. The wrap. A lot of sixes. Seven, eight, nine. Any seven, eight, nine. Dr. Lawyer Any make, four, seven, making eight, his nine. case to win a big pot. The dunch. Okay. Four, seven, eight, or nine. And there's the nine. T1000 gets there. <laughs> Draws are getting there on this stream today. Draws are getting there, and sets are going down in flames. Yeah, I don't think we've had a single one hold up yet. A couple. ACL says, the games at the Lodge are soft. I know, because I'm in them. <laughs> Joe, yes, PLO, the easy game. I know Joey would love to be here playing PLO. Is the net game on? Yes. No, 100. Yeah, 100. The rare, the rare PLO game here on the Lodge live stream, I think... Over the years that we've had streams, we've probably yeah, done it so about a half dozen yeah. times. Okay. We don't need buttons. Okay, just for yes, hold your, um, hold your action. So it's, it is a rarity. Hundred. Oh, knit game starting again. Uh, knit game, you know how this is. This is the fourth knit game. I believe they're playing for $100 per player. Can't lose. Win a hand. Show your winning hand. You can release the knit button back to Damon, the dealer. He should have a Last person with the knit button in front of them will pay each and every player $100. We can start that. Start fresh. If you lose two in a row, double. Any takers? No. Might be a little too rich for this game. Yeah, maybe you're right. Everybody other than me should be fine with it. <laughs> It'll be 1,600 or something. I don't know. It's, stacks aren't that deep. Yeah. It's 100? Steven with the only eight. Yeah, Steven flopped trips here. And the diamond draw. <clears throat> Nut diamond draw is the ace of diamonds is dry in Sweetwacker's hand. Yeah, not much else going on in this hand. I like the worst start hand ever, and I just 
hit everything. <laughs> Diamonds and an eight. Wow. <laughs> Steven's going to show his hand. I think Steven said he's going to try to make it down to ACL later today. I heard that's a big deal around these parts. It's a big deal. It's one of the biggest festivals in the country. It's two weekends, this weekend and next weekend. Some of the biggest musical acts from around the world come to ACL, Austin City Limits. Yeah, that's cool. cool. When I was in college, I was in a, a small music, I was in a music video for a small amount of time, a band called Il Nino. They filmed it in their concert at the WWE in New York City. It was very exciting. I have a screenshot of me and my friend in that video. Never heard of him. No, I didn't think you did. It's a, <laughs> it's like new metal. Like a, for all you viewers out there, you've heard of like Seven Dust and bands like that. There's the raise from Trust Fund Matt with the Cowboys. About time we got a double real hand. suited also for <clears throat> T Fund Matt. I like that NASA hoodie. Well, since all the cool kids are doing it. Six ways. To this flop. 2100 in the skillet. Damon will give us three. Wow. Steven. Couple nine. Steven just keeps flopping everything. He's got a boat. I love his lead out here. Hundred percent no one's putting him on Jack Nine leading out there. T Fun lays it down correctly. That's the only flop we're getting. <laughs> Steven shows how fortunate he is. Another, the only one laughing is Steven. <laughs> as he collects more money. I mean, once six people call, though, it's not so bad. The last time, at least, you were doing it for the net button, so we might have called this time. Uh, like, it was defense. You had to have the real hand for sure. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Steven and Steiner, both from. Arizona Steiner played the last couple streams. Yeah, two-time Arizona State champion Steiner is. It's hard to do in eleven over a thousand people in each field. That is very impressive. Yeah. And then his buddy over here finishes second in the World Series of Poker main event. I was talking to him earlier. I. I thought for sure there'd be people coming up to him and says, hey, here, wear my patch. Wear my company's patch. Here's $10,000, you know. So that didn't happen to him. Yeah, I guess patches aren't as popular as they used to be. Well, I think a lot of it has to do with the fact that WSOP isn't on ESPN anymore. Yeah. I mean, not nearly, I don't think not nearly as many people. On CBS now, right? Yeah, are, have, are able to view it. I watched My the, theory. the poker go coverage during the actual WSOP. Yeah, but I mean, when it's on ESPN and then it's on ESPN all summer long on yeah. the reruns, and it has a little bit more value for, for a sure. business to put a patch on you. Yeah. Just in case you hit, right? <laughs> Five ways to a flop. Suited aces. A little dangler seven. How about a set for T-Fund? There are no more sevens coming out. <clears throat> Four. That was close. Hearts do get there, but nobody with hearts in their hand.
So Mitch says, it's hard to fold aces. And there's the boat for T Fun. Flush out there, board pair out there, aces. Sometimes aces go down in flames. I feel PLO. like every time they go down, they go down in flames. PLO, a lot, lot different in PLO, though. Aces yeah. don't have as much cachet in yeah. PLO. <clears throat> don't have as much power yeah. in PLO, it seems. Especially multiway. So we're in the middle of the, our another knit game. This time they're playing for $100 per player. Last person with the knit button in front of them. How do you get rid of the knit button? All you got to do is win a hand and show your winning hand, and that's how you get rid of that knit button. Kind of like the game Hot Potato. I saw the color of your first car. Mine? No, that's the color. Seems like Sweetbacker may have dyed his goatee to match his hat and his shirt. <laughs> One black card is burning. A lot of information. Mine? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. I was doing so well. <laughs> I thought you'd never have to ask. They even give each individual card at this time. <laughs> Don't flip them. Flush draw for Dr. Lawyer here to go along with his cowboys. Gut shot, wheel draw, backdoor hearts for T-1000. Yes, ACL. We've had many people who don't like the knit game and have asked to... We try to get them to play at least once or twice on a stream, but after that, any, any player has the right to veto it and say, no, let's not play it. It's an interesting turn card. Dr. Lawyer gets there in a way he didn't think he was going to get there. He's not going to use his pocket kings. He's going to use his 600. lone five yeah. for the trips. Had an overpair and a king high flush draw. Ends up making three of a kind fives. But it's going to be Hiker who takes a stab at this. Will it get through? Is 1400 in there? No. 250. Could Dr. Lawyer really be considering a fold here? During the knit game? Don't think he's thinking about raising. It's just going to be a call or a fold, I think. When, you're, when your opponent's got a knit button in front of him, you've got to make the call here. It's easy for us. Well. it twice today if that helps you don't talk hiker don't talk 
Yeah, that that was uh, his nerves coming out right there. Lays it down. Wow, hiker. hiker. It was sort of. Oh my god, I had the same hand. Good luck. I had Queen Jack ten four. Hiker speech play. And Dr. Lawyer just got this bar. Thank you. Good good bet. Did you beat that? You had a jack? No, I had a five. You had a five? How do you do it? How do you, how'd you pull that one off? Uh, I didn't Let's look at Stephen that. Jones' I face I thought you had a when he he hears he had a five. I thought he did, too. It made, oh, made sense in my head. <laughs> Stephen Jones can't believe he made that fold with the five. Good play, Hiker. In his defense, Hiker didn't just win $6 million in the World Series. He's on a stricter budget. Pretty tilting. Oh, I'm sorry. It was Dr. Lawyer. Yeah, who, Dr. Uh, lawyer. Dr. Lawyer. Three type. Also didn't win six million in the, the main event. So. One hand also on a stricter budget. Would have ended up being the winner. So. I think I had zero. That would have been a winner. <laughs> I feel it was always nice. But... Kobe S says the lights are getting to him. It is different. I I don't often play on the stream. I got a chance to play on Monday during the Doyle Brunson day. It's a little different, folks. You know, looks easy, but once you get, once you realize, hey, not only am I playing this, but people are watching, yeah. and I don't want to make a fool out of myself. A lot of things come into play. Here we go. Four ways to a flop. How about the wheel for Samit? A set for Swede Whacker. What? This is where this game is so dangerous because you flop a, you flop the nuts, which is the wheel right now, and then you just gotta hold on. Yeah, you just gotta pray. I mean, you gotta dodge raindrops. Based on the way this hand played out, it's pretty impossible for anyone to have a set of aces, so Swedewhacker's only really worried about the straight instead of fives. Based on how he plays, I don't imagine he's going to be looking to fold his hand anytime soon. <laughs> Thanks, VW. Yeah, Yoda was on the stream, too. On Monday, that was fun. And just on cue, he folds his hand immediately. Shows you I have no idea what I'm talking about. <laughs> Can I get a Coke Zero, please? <laughs> Shows you the dangers of bottom set PLO board pairs. You're always worried about your full house. Absolutely. But then you got to wonder why did he play the hand if he's going to fold a set on that board? You are not alone, sir. <laughs> Now I still see the nitbot in front of him. Did he not show his hand? One time. <laughs> I don't, yeah. This is the third time you're playing this. Um, <laughs> no, I'm saying that one time when you asked, then they don't. No one, no he one did, seems to be talking about it. He did not it. show his hand. <laughs> yes. And no one seems to be I talking I'm about it. I'm just too relieved that I made it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, they're talking about it. Our relief didn't last long, though. No. Because <laughs> <laughs> he, he had problems before. He, he, did, he was asking a lot of questions on, now, do I show? Do I not show? So they were just joking a little bit. So, yes, Samit wins ball. with the wheel. Yes, sir. Doesn't show his cards, keeps the knit button. Maybe he's playing metagame. It wasn't worth the information to give up the knit button. It's always worth it to give up <laughs> the knit button, especially at $100 per player. That could be, an eight. That could be a $700 mistake. I think they're... People in poker generally hate being called a nit more than anything else. Even if you are a nit, you just don't like it. It's a meet with the nut flush draw. Not a whole lot else out there. 
That would have been a good spot for Samit to stab at the pot. This time I show. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Oh, he still got rid of it. Dust drop the coin. So he got another chance to show his hand. Three minutes left in the third. It's 15 13. He does, and he gets rid of his knit button. But they're in the field goal range. Denver is. 18 13. So they... Bentley, the, the lodge is located in Round Rock, just outside of Austin. No touchdown. <laughs> it's a short 20 minute uh, Uber or car ride from the airport. I'll take that. Austin Bergstrom International Airport. Fourth and one and get stopped. They wouldn't go for two. They would. Yeah, because. They could score. You could allow one touchdown and nothing else. Or just two field goals is fine. Yeah. I think that's more likely against the Jets' D, so. It's real sweaty. Yeah, it is. <laughs> what, uh, it's hard to pay attention to this game, though. The fourth start yet? No. Still in the third. You need a turnover. A turnover would be Take nice care, Jan Witt. Our number one fan from the Netherlands. Oh, that's a 10. We're huge in the Netherlands. What? So so okay. okay, so this counts as one. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, that's... All right, I fold. <laughs> Looking for a special flop. Six ways to this flop which has happened many times tonight, going six ways. T-1000 with a pair of jiggities in his hand. Everybody with hopes and dreams. Shout Even. out to Brad Owen. There it is. Flop a See? set. T-1000. Put his name out there, and, he fly, and the set comes. Flush draw for Swedewacker. Second Nut flush draw for Dr. Lawyer. This could get spicy with another spade. I almost messed that one up. What Dr. Lawyer also with the over pair of queens. He has shown a tendency to overvalue his hands a little bit. Should be interesting to see how he plays this. Steven, of course, with the naked kings. T-1000. About ready to say pot. Oh, shit. Okay. Sorry about that. Go ahead. Ooh, he's just reaching for calling chips? No, no, no chance. No, here we come. Yeah, no chance. I didn't think so. I mean. Yeah, there's no scenario where anybody should just be th calling there with 3,600 is now the bet. Swede Whacker says, hey, I got a nut flush draw here. This here I am. This is a pot or fold scenario right now for Sweetwacker. You can't just call this bet. Oops. Oops. There you go. Pot, he says. And that is going to put T1000 all in. It's an object, I guess. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, I guess have space. <laughs> Yeah. Huge pot, eighteen thousand nine fifteen. It's a nice hand. Not for long. Oh, I think I think he's holding. Wow. Oh my God, <laughs> Quadrophenia. <laughs> Not that spade. <laughs> Quadrophenia. Oh, no, 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 no. Twice, two times, two times. They're going to run it twice. 
Turn in river right. Cards still good? Yep, they were. Okay. I watched them. T-1000 is going to be able to get rid of his nit button at least. <laughs> Needs to fade. Four, four, four ball. Shot. Four. Wow, he holds. That's, that's he holds. Four or spade would have gotten a uh, sweet whacker there. Only spade he was allowed to hit. <laughs> scoop, scoop. 18,000. 780. 8290. 82, yes, 82, 82, 90. 82, 90. <clears throat> What's the max deck? Cumulative winnings. Mahesh up 9,300. T1000 now up about 9,300. Stephen Jones up 7,000. Trust there. fund Matt up 2195. Sumit 1325. Everyone else losing. Hiker down 1500. I took them off. Missouri who left down 6,000. Doctor Lawyer down 6290. And Swedewacker currently throwing the party down 15,390. So let's get a count. And Swedewacker wants to match the stack of the largest. Stack at the table. Roughly. I, he's, I think he's bigger than Three players still with their knit button. Yeah, the graphics are wrong. Mahesh. I got more. Dr. Lawyer. This is 15. Five. And Swede walk, Whacker. This is 10. A little more. 27. So this is 16. 26. 25. 27. 28. How about 26? I like 28. 28.80. 26 total. Uh, I need 26 total. 28. What's 2680 is what I have. Oh, I do just, just for the graph. It doesn't matter. Okay, he's gonna, he's gonna yeah, it's fine. Like 26, yeah. Just uh, 2880. 80. 80. Right? 20, okay. Probably because of all the tips. Yes, yeah, twenty six thousand. <laughs> and then, and then, uh, buttons here. And then all the nits. Twenty seven. T one thousand. Able to get it through that when that spade come out, came out. Wrong spade <laughs> for Swede Whacker. The only spade. Would have been exciting to see that card come out if they were still playing and not already all in. <laughs> Four. Four hundred. <laughs> you you want to do it? Looks like there's a two hundred dollar straddle. Sometimes. <laughs> From T Fun Matt and Mahesh declined to put the four hundred on. Said that is a little too much. That would be pretty. Impressive. Although he picks up pocket aces. Not suited though. Oh, see, you should have done it, man. Look at this. <laughs> Mahesh with the kind of hand that you'd you'd want to probably limp in for two and not open, if in case anyone was wondering why he didn't raise with aces. T1000 wearing his lucky lavender hoodie. Seven players to this flop. Wow. Oh, all the eights. All the eights and Sweet Whacker. Quads. Just matched the biggest stack at the table, too. So he's fully loaded. Mahesh says, I got a boat. I basically had the second nuts, right? I would have liked to see Sweetwacker lead out with the quads. I know it seems like a 
odd thing to do, but it's hard to put someone on quads when they lead out with it. Check mark. Sweet Wacker with the quads. Ooh, this Ooh. is going to hurt Mahesh. Ooh. Checks again. Mahesh now. Ace is over. Uh, probably but he makes the check. Good check. Good check, Mahesh. <laughs> you said good check? No. <laughs> yeah, I know. Ace on the river actually doesn't really change a <laughs> whole lot. A lot. as He only now beats pocket Mahesh kings. Kings got there on the turn. Wow. <laughs> I would have played way different though if he did. Yeah, I would have. <laughs> he, he's not in, yeah. We tried to tried to get him. Trips on the board. And there's seven people in. That's twenty eight cards. He's probably calling for the last eight. Taking it down. Pretty darn good shot that somebody's gonna pick up that last eight. Yeah. There's the V pips. Everybody's playing a ton. Sweetwacker with the 75% VK. Once it all 400, I was done, man. What a. Wait, you checked first and then you checked that? No, it was, it was no, 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 no you checked. Check oh, it shows you how interesting PLO is. Sweetwacker has a 75% VPIP, and Mahesh still folded aces full on the river there in PLO. I was on the flop itself, I was done. Yeah, but also, he's not even called him. He has an ace. Ace and king were out there, so. Yeah. I mean, I guess he can call the queens. And I was okay with that, to win that pod. I couldn't handle... Mm -hmm. Second quads. I couldn't handle a raise on that shit. In a row, two quads in a row. Jacks for T-1000 on hand number 56. Eights for Swedewacker on hand number 57. Six. Raise 600. Maybe a chance for quad tens here on this hand. We're just black. Don't mind. Hiker with some double suited queens. <sighs> Although not a great version of it with 7 3. Under two, then. Dr. Lawyer with the jiggities again. Two players, Mahesh and Dr. Lawyer, are battling to see who doesn't have to pay. $100 per player in nit tax. And Dr. Lawyer only working with 1900 in his stack. That's going to be very painful. Eights again. T1000. Start, start here. Oh, that's the yeah. yeah. Hits trips here. I'm, like, I'm last to act. Call in. Up five with the ball. <laughs> yeah, they, they created a turnover. No field goal. Let's go, baby. <laughs> All in for Dr. Lawyer. Yeah, so he has the nit button. Lot. It's not going to get I, through. I can't each side. It's like... T1000. I win them both, it'd be nice. 1975. T1000 should snap him off, and he does. Have you always been into sports betting, or Daniel. more so after your... Uh, I mean, uh, no, I have. Football. Okay. I'm decent at football. Like, and football's hard, too. But, I mean, obviously my sizing is a little higher. I'm slowly... Not going too crazy, but... You know, slowly amping, yeah. amping it up a bit. T1000 with a significant lead doesn't look like he has it, though. <laughs> he looks displeased by the situation. T1000 wants to, wants to run it one time. You did say that. Dr. Lawyer looking for a jack or some runners. Now looking for a jack. Does not come. And Dr. Lawyer keeps his knit button and gets stacked. The double whammy. If you don't rebuy in the knit game, you automatically lose the knit game. Yes. If anyone's wondering. That's if you still have a knit button. Yes. At that point, the knit game would end and you would owe, no matter how many knit buttons were on the table. You decide to play the knit game and you get stacked and decide not to rebuy. The knit game ends at that point and you owe the tax. And that's when it really hurts. When you have to come out of pocket for the knit game tax, that's when it really hurts. We've we've seen people go to yeah. the ATM, pay the tax, and leave. On our Monday stream, we had someone had to they busted and had to come out of pocket. Had coins. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
but you know. I think that's when it's like the worst. When it just comes out of your chip stack, it's like, all right, this is not great. But when it comes out of your pocket and as you're walking out the door, it's like, ah, we, that really. We unfortunately were playing for ten dollars per player. <laughs> They're playing for a hundred dollars per player. It's all relative. <laughs> well, as, maybe Taris wants to do five thousand a player. Yeah, Doctor Lawyer's gonna get chips. Brittany is gonna bring him some chips. Hesh needs to try and win a hand. He's he's gonna lose this knit game. <coughs> Correct. To so meet with another example of a hand where you would want to limp and not raise because you don't want to face three bet with that hand, even though ace king with pocket kings the in there hand. looks like a really Probably strong hand. Seat, no, no suits, <laughs> not so much. <laughs> Although, if this were eight or better, it would be with the ace deuce. Swede Whacker with suited ace, <laughs> pair of aces. <laughs> you can see, and that's a perfect example why you wouldn't want to raise it. ace king, king deuce. Player behind you wakes up with ace, ace, jack, three with the suit. Hiker with the nice rundown hand. Mahesh not upset about that card. Turns, trips. And there's the boat for Sumit. Don't really love Mahesh's lead. It's hard to get called by worse. You're better off letting someone bluff. Now he's going to get raised by pocket kings and have a tough decision. Remember, Chatsville, when you make a value bet, what worse hand is going to call you? In PLO, it's hard to say that Mahesh has a, a worse hand that could call him. Sit down. Sumit and Mahesh play a lot of PLO together. Mahesh would have won or wouldn't have lost. 18. Five years. He bets without the Have you been? I went once. I've been here three years. I went one time. How is it? Is it a shit? It was fun. I'm shit show. Like I I've been to a ton of festivals. Uh, I went to, I used to go to festivals all the time, and, uh... You ever go to a festival, Rick? Yeah. Yeah, just... Yes. Get burnt out. Yeah. I mean, Burning if Man? I had, if I had, no. Like, no. Girl. I wouldn't go out there. Yeah, I don't blame you. I wouldn't either. That's fair. Especially but, uh, this year. They got all caught in the mud. Yeah. I know what's... Stuck. That, how brutal was that? The, yeah. It doesn't sound fun. To go I'm not a festival guy. <laughs> I, I wouldn't mind the occasional concert. One, maybe two, three bands, yeah. but... I don't want to do a 12-hour day yeah. for a whole weekend. Five-day hangover. Ah, I'm more of a state of fair kind of guy. Oh, okay, I could do that. Like weeks out. Give me a corn dog. <laughs> really? Maybe go on a ride. Yeah. High eating contest or something. And, like, just different I could do that. Mm. If we're talking do we have state fairs right here? Oh, God. Yeah, well, you can't Texas you state fair is going yeah. on right now. The biggest state fair in the country. Up in Dallas. That's a good three-hour drive. Some HTV5. Help goes a long way. You prepare. It's a... That's a call, and that's, that's uh, a race. Race to 100. Yeah, I don't, I don't always have the best self-control in those environments. Okay. So you go, you you go a little, yeah. It got a little hard. Yeah, yeah. Like, that's what are we doing that's, after? That's different. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, safer. Little mystery yeah. hand for Doctor Lawyer. Don't know what he has, but Stephen flops a boat. Stephen Jones doesn't always play his hand, but when he does, he flops a full house. <laughs> so yeah, I'll probably see you there. 
<laughs> Based on Dr. Lawyer's play, this board is in his range, but Stephen Jones has this board pretty well locked up. So I'm going to guess that Dr. Lawyer's got some sort of combo straight draw, flush draw hand, willingness to bet into three other players on that board. I'm going to say he's got the Jack of Diamonds, the Nine of Clubs, and Ace King. Ace King, Jack Nine. Diamonds. That's what I'm saying, yes. There's Rain Man's guess. <laughs> he does have the knit button, so frankly, he could have just about anything. I think Dr. Lawyer just got there with the diamonds. Not that it matters because it's no good. I want to see Steven check here. Putting the knit pressure on. 1700. Super polarizing to play his hand that way. Anybody wants a hmm? shot of tequila? Huh? Shot of tequila? I'm okay. In case anyone wasn't paying attention, I very much misread Dr. Lawyer's hand. No, this knit, this knit game is. Yeah, I think. Sweetwhacker asks Does anybody want a shot of tequila? The last one I went to, it was uh, my. Are they serving him in the bunker? Oh, yeah. He's, he's, he's got thousand. tequila. About like 20, 30,000 people. Yesterday I, so I saw, John, I think that was John brought in shorter people. That, a couple of nice bottles. Oh, yeah, had that nice tequila was, bottle was, and then the McAllen rare cast. McAllen and then he brought British Bulldog, a bottle of. <clears throat> it was wall to wall for. <laughs> cognac that was. Everywhere. And so, like, very short, nice like, bottle of cognac. Yeah, kind of yeah I like the cognac. And... Where is it? Yeah, that's, that's too much. Zilker yeah. Park? I would feel I'm like a bourbon guy, but you know, I'm open to anything. Like I mean, it, it, took, it took 15, 20 minutes to walk to, out, of, out the of the Yeah, yeah. That's, get out. I hate that shit. And you're not even close to the front. Dr. Lawyer with a really speculative call. Uh, 50, yeah. Three amigos. Steven flopping yeah. top pair, but he would have rather have hit a set. A pair of eights for T fund and not much else for Dr. Lawyer in there. Dr. Lawyer going to get after it a little bit. And he gets there. Looks like Dr. Lawyer will be getting rid of his knit button just in the nick of time. Or should I say just in the knit of time? 1825. I've always felt it's very polarizing when a player bets the pot and they announce the exact size of the pot they were keeping track of. It feels like a, a super nutted way to bet. Three checks out. Could be a superhero call. I'd love to see a bluff. That is not a bluff. Nine seven. Yeah, That's nine, not a bluff. Yeah. Nice hand. Yeah, the six was uh, no good. You had you had spades too, right? Yeah. Shut in. Now love the six. Doctor lawyer got rid of his knit button. The knit oh, game has nice. ended. Knit tax is paid. Hundred dollars to each player. 
That is correct. He got you yes. for the. He got you for that one too. Yes. Okay. Mahesh pays it out there. You see the cumulative winnings. T1000, big winner right now. 13 7. Stephen Jones up 7,300. Mahesh, Sumit, and T Fund, all winners. Hiker down 2370. Dr. Lawyer 8520. Swedwhacker throwing the party today down 14,415. Anything below a jack. Get a lot out. Yeah, anything above is like 10 or higher. Ten or higher, I'm calling. We can't really call much else. Airboard. Heidi's king, queen, queen. One, one spade. Mm. Get called there sometimes. I don't know. Not close. Uh, the six is not great. Six isn't good. Steven showing you right there his his Misspades. significant understanding of PLO. Two to days with so pocket deuces on the button and still folded. Relevant one too. Not many people would find a fold there, but he understands how little value that hand actually has. Or I guess like one for hand. I don't know. I don't know. I could go either way. Oh no, you're waiting. Can I get another water, please. Oh, look at that. The Jets found a team they could beat. <laughs> what what is it? Mahesh with the set, top set. Still 21, okay. So still 13. Yeah, it's great. It's great. You still have a touchdown, a touchdown to give. And, and would, if they if they, they would go for two. they would go for two, and if they, they miss that, two. then I can even give up another field goal too. Yeah. This is really good. You're in a nice spot. <laughs> Mahesh. This is really good. You went. You went. Gonna take this pot down. <laughs> Uh, yeah. I like it. Earning like back it. his knit tax might, money. Might just Matt from might work, the lodge will deal anything <laughs> that day, man. players <laughs> want to play. Friday as long as there's enough day, interest, so the lodge. I was at a game on Friday night, a mixed game. We were playing a combination of Drama Hob, Badoogie. Yeah, Friday I lost 17. So. And for my birthday, we did a, a single draw, deuce to seven game. So it was not a mixed game. It was only single draw, deuce to seven. It was a one-two blinds game. It was a lot of fun. Got the llama in the game. So the answer is yes. The lodge will deal whatever the players want as long as there's enough interest. Has to be enough interest for us for it to make sense, and they'll add it to the string of tables. Uh, yeah. Yeah. He's, uh, he, he seemed like a nice guy. Yeah, he's, he's married, he, the married one. Yeah, he runs. Mm -hmm. He's he runs a lot of the games. I uh, haven't oh, played short deck oh, here at the lodge. I have not seen it, oh, okay. and I don't think it's ever no, been dealt at the either. lodge. But oh, okay. you never know what's yeah, in the future. Do Albert, come on down. I'll play it with you. Private club. Oh, so you can members club. So yeah, yeah. So you can just. Oh, so you can. It's do some type of private out there. You can only sit down with the invite. Oh, okay. So anyone can kind of do that though, basically, or. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, but you have to recruit. You talk to the yeah, talk yeah, to yeah, management. Yeah. Yeah. You yeah. send it out. Yeah. 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 I've played all over the world. This is the friendliest of poker players. This guy is really. It's, this state, yeah. It's super nice. It's, yeah. it, I also yeah, played all over. I, I really have a couple met flush draws out there. Mickey one thousand with the nut flush draw. Sweet whacker with the king high flush draw. But with the board is paired, so no one's gonna be going too crazy over it. What's in there? Uh, 150. Houston maybe is in this player friendly. <laughs> if you're strapped. <laughs> yeah, no, you're absolutely right. Austin. Yeah. Why is it big games or something? No. You, you can get robbed pretty easy. <laughs> oh, strapped. That's what you mean by strapped. I was thinking. I was thinking cash for some reason. Strapped with cash. Okay. No, that, I mean that is Drop the one thing. Like, uh, yeah, you just have to. A lot of shady shit, huh? Be careful. I mean, 
You have to be careful everywhere. Everywhere, yeah, exactly. I love as that a shirt. It, Thank you. Oh man, I just noticed that. <laughs> That's a good shirt. I've been, I've been, li I've been living up to it. <laughs> no, you have. <laughs> no matter where you go, you're gonna hear. I need to get a shirt like this. <laughs> you're gonna hear people getting followed home and people getting, you know, robbed and stuff, and you have, you just have to be careful. Yeah, that's. Well, it's nice. That, to have that happened in Florida. Here, it's nice to have security walk us out. Yeah, they have lockers here. Yeah. yeah, they do. They do a good job with that. It happened a lot of my friends in Florida. Big week coming here at the Lodge as Rampage and Mariano are going to make their way back to town. Yeah, We've seen Mariano to, yeah. a couple times since the last yeah, time we yeah, saw Rampage. Yeah, the, the lockers here are really nice. The lockers are great. Interesting. Notice to me not re-raising with the ace, ace king seven, the ace king yeah, suit so in there. Four hour access all the time to breathe together. That's the kind of hand you'd want to thin the field a little bit. Cash. Yeah. yeah. Interesting. Swedewhacker with a massive draw hand to meet with the nut flush draw. And, and the aces. And the aces. And Hiker in there with at least a club draw and a pair of tens. Two pair. This pot might get large. 65.5. I don't know if I like Hiker's Raise here. Over to Summit. Got the nut flush draw. Pair of aces. Facing a... There he goes. He's going to put it all in. I don't see any scenario where Sweetwacker folds. I'll stay at your hotel. You can let me have one. Huh? I'll stay at your hotel. You can let it's me have one. Unlikely he's sharing his straight cards with other people. <laughs> and if you play that hand and you flop open-ended with a flush draw, you're not really looking to fold. He's going to gamble. And he's going to put it all in. Twice is good. And a hiker. Twice. Two times for everything. All in here. This is really, really bad. Hiker's all in here. And a bad club draw. Do I have to show? Oh, he has a nice club draw. For the fans, like yeah. Six, yeah. The fans, Sweetwacker, with the, yeah. the open ender, his flush draw is <laughs> kind of irrelevant. Every one of these players has clubs in their hand. Two five. Yoda is going crazy in chat. Lord have mercy, please hold. <laughs> Hikers. Six in your hand or an ace? Who she's cheering for? <laughs> <laughs> Not many clubs left in this deck. Thirty thousand dollar pot, folks. Oh, you yeah, have like seven high clubs okay, with five, six, seven. Oh, it was you have? You know, he has two pair. Oh, he has two pair. Flash draw as well. No, and three. And okay, yeah, yeah, I'm, 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 I'm obliterated. <laughs> there are three flush draws in this hand. Yeah, yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. oh, oh you clubs? I should have gotten out of this. Clubs are gone. Oh, six of clubs. Oh no. Wow. Yes. Yeah, four. 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 There it is. Oh, six. Six. And my goodness, <laughs> the six for Swedewacker. <laughs> the, he cannot six. believe what fell. <laughs> 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 
Jesus Christ. I'm He's so good at this. Uh, <laughs> what a sick man. I forgot they were running it twice. Like, They're going to run it twice here. Did I forget my stuff? Yeah, you have yeah. to pull you. Yeah. Apparently. Yeah. Sweet Whacker oh, yeah, yeah. picks up some more help here. Wow. Seven of clubs, and wow. Sumit will win with his flush. So Hiker. Loses all of his chips. Sumit and Swedwacker will chop the main. I just wanted to And Swedwacker. Yeah, thanks, man. Ouch. Man, Hiker had climbed all the way back out of that hole and then. Yeah. Okay. That's what PLO will do to you. Hopefully, I'll see you around. Oh, okay. I guess I did. As we're going to wave goodbye to Steven. The pedicabs. Those are fun. The what? The pedicabs. People like riding bikes with crates in the back. You hop oh. in instead of like walking. I think that's probably, yeah, uh, totally it's, worth it's the move. Yeah. Especially uh, after. A $30,000 pot. Do you know what time is it? It goes to go all night. Gets it's chopped up between Sweetwacker and Sumit. Yeah, or 10 or midnight. <laughs> it, it doesn't go past midnight. Crazy, yeah. Uh, Today's the last we night, though, I think, right? You yeah. get a couple of stacks of mm, yeah. I remember, like, it ending at, like, I don't think you should, though. No. We're not alone. You just want uh, four? Yeah. Uh, so, uh, I was yeah. just asking. I think maybe, like, I will... Appreciate uh, it. Yep. Uh, uh, because, uh, sometimes, I... I don't know. I'll, I'll ask. I prefer five, one, or nine. I, I think, yeah. I got denied before, as well. So I think they technically don't do it during, oh, not during streaming. Damon. Damon, are you allowed to... Uh, yeah. Uh, Damon, are you allowed to switch seats or not? Okay. Adding 10,000. Yes, Stephen Jones, uh, it is... It was our pleasure to have Stephen here along with his buddy Steiner, both from the Phoenix area. Good, um, both, breakfast. obviously, yeah. Stephen yeah. finished second in yeah. the World Series of Poker main event oh, this past yeah. summer Downtown. for $6 million. His buddy Steiner, two times in a row, nice meeting you. Arizona State Champion. Won fields of over 1,100 in each field in the last two years. So he went back, back to back, back to back. Wow! Best of playing with him. Nice meeting you. Yeah. That is super impressive. Yeah, Winning any tournament back to back, even a nine-handed sit and go. Uh, I do a federal employment contract. Thank you. Yeah. Business, See you. Uh, employment contracts. Okay. Business. We will fill Steven's seat. Pretty much everything. Okay. Yeah. Is it fun? It can be. Chatsville, I'm curious, what do you guys find to be more impressive? His back-to-back -back yeah, state championship titles or Mark Newhouse getting fifth in back-to-back -back main events? <laughs> I mean, getting ninth ninth in back-to-back -back main events. I don't know why I said fifth. Well, obviously, the field <laughs> for the main event is much more than 1,100. It's pretty darn impressive. Interesting, Yoda. Newhouse, huh? I mean, yeah. Newhouse had to dodge thousands and thousands more people <laughs> each year. Not not taking anything away from Steiner. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, we all know how hard it is to win a poker tournament. Winning back-to-back? -back? Jesse, <laughs> you're, a, you're the cage manager at the <laughs> lodge. You are a – you should be good at math. <laughs> ah. I have calculators. Is is ninth out of eight thousand better than first out of eleven hundred? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Looks like Doctor Lawyer is going to come in and spice it up with this. Nine hundred. Nine hundred. Mostly mediocre hand. One. To oh, yeah, that's a, that's, that's 30 a, something, 300. I wasn't sure if that was a red or a pink. I just wanted no, to no, make no, sure that's all he had. So if you want us to play, it'll play.
Mahesh with the straight. <clears throat> Elliot, you must use two and only two in PLO. Have to use two from your hand. Oh, I Two from your hand, three from the board to make your best possible hand. Yoni checking in, says Hiker is looking slightly sick. Don't blame him. Yeah, that was a tough one. Hiker told me earlier today that the Lodge stream, last time he was here, he lost the biggest pot he ever played with in his life. This one was another big one he can put in the memory book. Uh, how you, if you can sue Matt for all the pots he's won against? <laughs> I that can do that, man. Let's do it, but he hasn't won any pots for me yet. <laughs> You moved to Austin yeah, from New, New York? From, from Houston. I moved so Swim to is the new player. He will take okay, okay. Yeah. Stephen's seat. Swim time. is a longtime okay, nice. lodge yeah. crusher. Plays PLO. How old are you? Uh, 25. A ton here at the lodge. Warm here. I think it's cold. It's nice and cold. Gotcha. So this is the first... Yep, yeah, yeah. Looks like he's buying him for yeah. 30? Uh, I played. Is that, what I, is that what I'm seeing? Through law school. I did. So, yeah. Yep. Well, I paid off. Looks like it. Law school loans. <laughs> playing poker, so. Just something I kind of do on the side now. Yeah. Now that is a nice looking hand, Mahesh. Double suited. Double All in suited a row. Run down like that. And T-1000 picks up a little pocket aces, one of them suited. I'd like to see Mahesh do a limp a three-bet right here. You get really hot in here. I definitely don't want to be playing Mahesh's hand eight ways, seven ways. There it is. As it's unlikely he would have limped three bet with an ace's hand, T1000 has probably picked up on that and going to put in the four bet, and these guys will probably play a big pot heads up. Pot. Pot from T1000. Woo. 6270. 6270 is the bet. For sure, there's a part of Mahesh that's regretting his three bet. <laughs> and Mahesh. Yeah, it's over 10. We'll make the call. I believe they're going to run it twice. This hand is better. You see, equity wise, T1000 at 59%, Mahesh at 41%. Which in PLO is about as much of an advantage as you can have. <laughs> Did they say how many times they're running it? They're running it twice. Two full boards. How about a top set for T1000 on board number one? Mahesh looking for a king eight. or an eight. Yep. Doesn't come. First board goes to T-1000. And he says it. Always good to win that first one. That means he's probably jinxed himself for the second one. Wow. He's saying keep him low. That's as safe as it gets for ACA's queen deuce.
And T1000, scoop, scoop, 18,260. And Mahesh is going to pull out some more chips from his pocket. Nice, man. Look at all those chips. Can we get this guy a color up? I like that chip stack. Reminds me of those old WSOP chip stacks from like 2009. Cumulative ranks T1000. Absolutely killing the game right now. Up 23,460. Stephen Jones has left us up 7,200. Sumit T Fund, the only other winners. Throwing the party right now. Swede Whacker down 12,500. Our man Hiker down 88.75. Yeah. Dr. Laurie with a premium. It's a nice looking hand. Choosing to lead here. Sumit's going to come along with his gutter ball and a pair. Like Mahesh is jamming. That wasn't dark, though, I don't think. What's in it? Twice, two rivers. Pot is forty-five seventy-five. Mahesh all in for the second time in as many hands. And Mahesh needs some help. There's the seven for Mahesh. He's going to get at least his money back. Now let's see if he can scoop. That's you. Drop it up. <laughs> and chop it up. <clears throat> Folks, you're not going to want to miss this one. Saturday night. We made seven. Terrace. Rampage, Mariano, Doug Polk, Bulldog, all will be in the studio under the lights on Saturday. It's going to be a big game. I don't know what they've decided on playing. On the, I would imagine 5,100 yeah. is where they'll start. Uh, don't know for sure on that, but it'll be a big game. You're not going to want to miss Rampage, Mariano coming to town. Like bad and big. On Sunday, yeah, we will have with, like bad storm damage of both the hotels and the I believe the semifinal yeah. and the final the table yeah. of the I Heads Up Open hoping. tournament that we're running, yeah. October 13th through the 15th. Nice. It's been rough a few weeks. Get to the lodge, 
this week for the Heads Up Open. You can re-enter once per day. $1,000 gets you in. Once there's eight players that want to play, that'll be a flight. Yeah, I'm lucky. Win that flight, you move on to the next round. We'll cap it at 128 players. Yeah, I don't Doug see Polk will be playing in that one. The parking garage. I heard he's pretty good at heads up. Uh, that would be pretty, pretty, ugly. pretty good. Uh, that was a good Larry uh, David right there. Yeah, pretty, yeah. pretty good. You enjoy watching Curb? Oh yeah, yeah. Curb your enthusiasm best. It's fantastic. Yeah. Somebody asked me to describe that show once to him. I said, okay, think of a snowball at the top of the hill, and as it rolls down the hill, it gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Yeah. And by the end of the show, whatever started small is giant. Yeah, that's a good way of describing it. <laughs> Some speculative hands here. <clears throat> Mahesh with his standard flop top set. That flush draw for some meat to go along with his straight. I don't know how I feel about Mahesh's lead here. I mean, I guess he's just trying to get his chip stack in there with top set. Meat just calls here, flopping the nuts. With the nut flush redraw, wow. Well. Boys again? Oh, you're called boys. Boys. I'm ahead. Wrong twice? Yep. Mahesh wow. needs some help here. Mm -hmm. yeah, the board or queen. Maybe a queen yeah, or a board pair. Okay. We'll get him home. Oh, sorry. oh, and diamonds. And diamonds, wow. Yeah, diamonds too. I know. That's a lot more. <laughs> yeah. Ton of outs. And queen. Jeez Louise. Okay. Diamonds. Diamonds get there from a hash. <laughs> what a setup. Yeah. That's... <laughs> and there's the board, the board pair. Out. Mahesh is going to scoop his buddy some meat. <laughs> nice end. Yes, wins. We, uh, what can you do on that? That's, that's so really many good. cards every now and then. We'll miss something. Hands like that. He did have a diamond draw. And that's how he got there on the first board. Matt, I see your question. How do you guys usually pay out large sums? Uh... One large sums is a little subjective. Not everyone has the same number in mind. Two times could not uh, the answer to that question could be cash, could be chips, could be a check, could be a wire transfer. It all depends on the situation and the person in question. I think so. Yeah, just don't say it. Yeah, well, I wish I had run something like that against James yeah. Big yeah, Hand. I think that on that, on that Queen jet 10, it. 9 double suited, but I can't even hit one board out on that shit. I jinxed it. <laughs> Mahesh, hey, be, with oh, the oh, smile, is back on. Easy. Wins, we do not yeah, take crypto. Oh, yeah. That, that would, <laughs> that's about GG. I know where it's going to be. Mackenzie checks in the chat. I was just thinking about <clears throat> E. Mackenzie the other day when we saw that Rampage was coming to town. One of Rampage's first ever lodge streams was when he had under 10,000 subscribers. Played in a huge hand. The punt heard round the world where he punted his entire stack in the biggest game he ever played with at that time. Not now. 
He's played in some big games, but at that time, punted it off to E. McKenzie. A very memorable hand back in our old room. I don't know if I ever saw that hand. It was pretty famous. Pair for T Fund. <laughs> That's funny, E. McKenzie. He's, he says, Yeah, but now he's playing 200, 400, heads up with Doug, so who really won? <laughs> Let me tell you. Oh, you're going to find four or five in there. Rampage yeah. is one hell of a player. He's won a few bracelets. He just won in the. Australia, a huge tournament. He's just crushing life right now. If I had to use one word to describe, to describe Rampage, I'd say heart. The dude has so much heart. He'll just go for it, but yet he also cares about his followers and his friends. The dude just has so much heart. Yeah, he's, we, I mean, we got, to, we got to know him when he was just really starting. And uh, he and Mariano were kind of like the... Uh, the Andrew Brad combination, only it was Mariano Rampage. They 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 were two tag teams, if you will. Yeah. And uh got to know them and Rampage has just since really taken the poker world by storm and we're gonna be happy to see our old friend again this week. Good to see. It's good to see success. You know, Poker Face Ash was here last week commentating. We had her on when she had 5,000 subscribers. We had probably 10,000. We had more subscribers than her when she came to visit the first time. Yeah, she did, she did a very good job. I enjoyed listening to her. Hiker. Gut shot to a straight flush here. And Dr. Lawyer chasing his straight draw, showing you that it's dangerous to chase straight draws when there's a flush out there. He might not get there and have the best in. Check mark though for Dr. Lawyer. Nothing's going right for Hiker right now. Turn the air back on. It was really cold earlier. Yeah, Copacabana's. Hiker's going to make a play here to try to take the pot. Dr. Lawyer hits a king on the river for just one pair. This should work a good amount of time, even though it looks like a, an obvious call. It, not so much. His story makes sense to have one pair beat. The way this hand played out, he could be value betting a set of fours or a set of queens easy. What's your name again? Good bluff there. What's your name, name again? That's been there. Uh, what was uh, your name? What's your name? Name. Carrie. Carrie. Yes. I think I'm Carrie. hiker on on the stream. Oh, okay, so you, I, I talked to you on. Uh... Right. Oh, okay, okay, nice, nice. Yeah, I think Thursday. We no, what not Thursday? Last week we were talking. Copacabana uh, is in chat. 
He said he was he played with Rampage Mariano in August of 2021. You know, we're coming up on our third year anniversary for the stream in just a few weeks. Over 420 live streams in the books, all in our archives. That's how November. 2020 <laughs> was when we started this whole thing. Hit the six. Actually started a little early, <laughs> earlier than that, because we used to, like we had a few months where we didn't even do live streams. We did recorded episodes. But we're going to say our first live stream was November 2020. No, he got it in with just like five high and mm. got there. Not the, not the best, best play in my <laughs> Set of Cowboys for T1000. <clears throat> Open if Ender in live from Mahesh. The right call. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Flush draw for Swim. Copa Cabana, it's been my pleasure. I'm just a small piece of this great show, and I'm just proud to be here. Proud to be a part of it. Straight for T-1000 to go along with his set. But it's Swim who's going to take a stab at it. Bet's pot. Thousand thinking to himself, nine jack would be a bad beat here, but I'm going nowhere. I'm going to make the call. Swim looking for a heart. Doesn't come. Check mark for T1000, and he just keeps winning. Let's see if what he does here and what Swim does. Swim going to take another stab at it. He does have the jack. He does not. <laughs> and T-1000 is going to show the straight. Ooh. It always feels when you have a hand like Swim's. Like, how did I possibly miss? Yeah. And T-1000 is having one of those nights, folks. Where do I buy one of those lavender hoodies? That is a nice hoodie, actually. Thank you, bud. Thank you for that comment. Now, there's a lot of people, a lot of people. Skull Mike and I are fortunate enough to drive in the front seat of this great show. But there's so many people that make it happen. Our production staff, the dealers that we have, every employee here at the lodge. It's a good place to be, folks. The best place. Y'all gonna want to run another knit game, or? Yeah, we can do one more. Yes, sir. T1000 oh, with a suited ace, oh, keeping that hot streak going. Oh, He's yeah. building a city over there with all of his <laughs> chips. He really is. He's gonna have to start paying property taxes soon. <laughs> gonna be one of those five racks. <laughs> to the cage days. <laughs> Fuck. 
Got shot to a straight flush for Sweetwacker. Also, a little bit of a wrap oh, action. Yep, got the wrap. Mesh with a smaller stack and a top two pair it means we're probably going to be getting it all in on this board. D1000 should be able to just get out of the hand right now. No, I guess he's going to ride his hot streak and keep going. Almost certainly Sweetwhacker is going to be raising it up here. Of course he doesn't, just like I said. <laughs> How about now a set for T1000? I mean, he, he's winning every hand. Why not this one? And another check mark. Ho hum. T1000 can be confident he has the best hand. I'm going to bet King 10 on the turn. Easy game, T-1000. Easy game. <clears throat> Somewhere out there in Sarasota, Florida, Running pure. his mother is smiling. And all the good behavior in Europe. <clears throat> Yellow chips are 1,000. Purple chips, 500. Black chips, 100. Green chips are 25, red chips are 5. If you happen to see over there on Sweetwacker stack in the front row, a piece of bubble gum, that's $5,000, that pink chip. Don't see any $25,000 chips. We had some on last night. No, you just need Our man, British Bulldog, had a couple of the Longhorn chips, 25. Really Those burnt orange chips are very pretty. I need, I need okay, I'm W up yet. That's true. <laughs> you have doubled him up, but he doesn't. Sarah Grotic, there was an old song by Hall and Oates. <laughs> Sarah Smile. That's what you're doing right now. I do it when I get done over. <laughs> Four ways to a flop. Swim. Couple pair. Dry ace in his hand. Is Top and bottom pair is a little stronger having the ace of spades in his hand. Let's see if T1000 can run him down. If there's anybody who could, it's him. <laughs> Although having a ten in his hand hurts. He's got the he's got the the wrap. Oh, and he, he does have the full wrap. Yeah, yeah he's yeah, got yeah. the wrap. He does have the full wrap. And there's the seven. T1000 cannot lose, folks. And not only is it the seven, but it's seven of clubs, not the seven of spades, too. I mean, if this were the fire truck Friday, he'd be, he'd be collecting... So much money right now. Hand after hand after hand. Kill pot next hand. Just everything going his way. Back ten. Hmm? Back ten. Nobody at the table is even saying anything like, running good there? <laughs> They're all expecting him to take everyone out for dinner after the show. 
Hey, T1000 makes, he, follow him on Instagram. He makes some great food. Always makes a nice steak. Does he? Oh, yeah. T1000. He's a good cook. We talk about that a lot. You got some good chefs that play and work here. Sleep the two. If anyone gets a chance to try Cameron Mixon's uh, salsa, I highly recommend it. The Pitmaster General. I like his barbecue better than his salsa. Really? I don't know if I've had his barbecue. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> I went to Terry Black's last week for the first time. Yeah. That was quite the experience. Yeah. More expensive than I thought it was going to be. I was surprised by that. Barbecue ain't cheap. No. We got a beef rib. It was like $60 for a beef rib. Yeah, but it was like a Fred Flintstone rib. Yeah, it was the size of my head, yeah. What was he talking? It's blind, too. Oh, okay. Then I was... Skull Mike checks in the chat. It's all T-1000 today. You would have raised. He's won like yeah, 17 pots yeah, in a like row. Uh, I didn't hear He it. can't afford to fold. Any doubt that Queen Jack is coming? There's a Jack. I probably just have Jack Jack King Queen. <laughs> See, now they're talking about it. <laughs> Jack Jack King Queen. Mix in poker. Here's his name. Pipes up. How you doing, Mixon? Don't forget, Mixon, you still owe me some more salsa. I keep reminding you every time I see you. Now T-1000 is just playing with him. Dr. Lawyer with his Cowboys is going to lay it down. And T-Fun's going to lay it down. No one wants to tangle with T-1000. 18 hands in a row. I don't know if that's true, but it seems like it. <laughs> He wants a hundred. Buy in Matthias was 2K, match the stack. So it's long past the 2K. Biggest part of the day was 30,770, a hand between Hiker, Swedewacker, and Sumit on hand number 64. I think this is the last half hour of the stream. What's the time? Like 6.30? Mm -hmm. We're playing till 645? No, no, no. Skull Mike says that's a lot of chips in seat 8. Yes. T-1000 is building condos in seat 8 with his chips. Sounds good, Mixon. Well, look at that nice looking hand. Queen, Queen, Jack, Jack, double suited. Get him a hash. Good luck. Mahesh with a hand that looks like it's good, but eh, not great. Not great. T1000 definitely making lemonade today. Cumulative winnings happen every five to seven hands, so hang tight. You'll see them soon. Swim with the flush draw. If a black five comes here, we need to shut it all down. <laughs> he shouldn't be seeing the turn. Can he afford to fold? Over. Let's see, let's see if the run, run is over. Are they going to rabbit yeah. hunt it? Yeah. I've won like six hands in a row. Six? You won like it's ten hands in a row. Okay. It's over. <laughs> Four, six. Oh, yeah. The swim would have also missed. Too bad it wasn't the fire truck game, huh? That would, that would have been a, <laughs> a good run there. <clears throat> All good things come to an end. What a run by T-1000. There's your cumulative winnings. T-1000 up 33,500.
Stephen Jones, who's left, up 72-30. Samit and Tifon, the only other winners. Swedewacker throwing the party down 15,000. Dr. Laurier, 9,100. And our man, Hiker, down 8,500. Hiker's about to take his bolo off and throw it in the corner. <laughs> now he's a good man. Doesn't get on tilt. One of the nicest guys you can meet. Glad I can call him my friend. Six ways. Hiker with a flush draw here. No surprise, though, that T-1000 currently has the best hand. Oh, no, he Top doesn't. Set Dr. For Lawyer. Dr. Lawyer. Top set? Oh, middle set. Middle set. Middle for... set. Yeah, I missed that. Okay. About time he made a big hand. I feel like he hasn't made any big hands yet. Dr. Lawyer is going to take one down. Yeah. All pressure, buddy, if you want. You're not going to want to miss this one. Coming in November, our winter tournament series, the main event, 500K guarantee, $500 buy-in, November 26th. Through December 3rd. You're not going to want to miss this one. The main event, $500 buy-in. Oh, yeah. It's going to go way over that, the 500K guarantee, I believe. Looks like we got the $50 straddle on this one. It's hard to figure out the right bounty amount because it depends yeah. on, like, the game dynamics. Because sometimes it'll be like... Well, Hash working with a suited ace and some jiggities. Seems too small for this game. <laughs> no sevens in the field. Not a, not a very action flop. Hesh's Jacks way in the lead here. Jacks will hold Jackson Sevens. <clears throat> SV Thora, thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Next time is going to be Thursday. We'll put the headset on the wall. Greg Potter, Iron Mike Brady will be the commentators Thursday as Rampage makes his way into town. This isn't officially part of the Doug Polk challenge, but it is going to be heads up against Doug Polk Thursday. Time still to be determined, somewhere around the 2 o'clock hour. Going to start a little earlier than usual. Tune in Thursday, Doug Polk and Rampage. Another nice looking hand for Dr. Lawyer. Swim with a nice looking hand. That's the kind of board that's going to slow everyone down a little bit.
Dr. Lawyer with the Dry King. How about a boat now for swim? But it's going to be Dr. Lawyer with the smaller boat that's going to fire yeah, out. So Quick call from swim. Swim is going to show him the bad news. Slick Rick and Jesse, the cage manager, been here six months, already telling everybody where to go eat barbecue. <laughs> There's the V-Pips, meaningless in this game. Who cares about V-Pips in PLO? Everybody's going to play a lot of hands. Before. Favorite part of... Being in Austin, what, what, what have you enjoyed most? Besides the fact that the Lodge is in Austin. Yeah, forget it. Forget, we, we know you love the Lodge. Okay. We know it's your pride and joy. All you right. wear everything yeah, you have <laughs> has the Lodge imprinted yeah. on it. Yeah. But aside from that. I think, uh, strangely as it is, the weather. Because in Vegas, everything is so just bland. You know, there's just no weather in Vegas. But here, there's rain, there's hell, there's tornadoes, there's... <laughs> It's just, it keeps you on your toes. It, I, I can actually go to sleep and I can listen to the rain outside my window. Yeah, thank, well, we yeah. didn't have rain for a while, but yes, I understand what you're saying. That's been nice for me, because growing up in New York, we had weather, and I missed the weather in Vegas. Top set for T-1000. He's back to his old ways. Vincenzo, Stephen Jones did not go bust. He won 7,500 and had to leave early. Going to a festival downtown. Wow. I had it. T1000 should do whatever he can to keep this game going as long as he can. Yeah. <laughs> I got one 400 in there. Ooh. Mesh has an 8, right? Cageman is super baked with that weather answer. Exactly, yeah. Oh, yeah, you got a blind all <laughs> Looney Liz checks in the chat. You have exactly pot. One of the all time moves on stream yeah. history, yeah. on live stream history. That'd be a Liz, sign, the right? dealer. It means you have to pot it. Says hiker with the sick bolo tie. Respect Liz knows. She's got it. Bucci's got it. Skull, I'm not sure what you were implying with that weather. All in moment for Mahesh. <clears throat> Suited aces. Not too shabby. Hot plus 10. And Dr. Yeah. Laura again with the jacks. 10 or 1635. Little jacks, run down hands. Nice. Oh, <laughs> Skull is right. We've had more days in the hundreds this year than any other year, I think. Compared to Vegas, though, it's still a lot of weather. Vegas just has no weather. T Fun will get out of the way. I can, Let's see. I can call him the hat. You can call me? Oh, oh my God. I have double suited aces. In the world. Uh, How do you... <laughs> <laughs> That's bizarre. That's what he started the game with, doubling up with double suited aces. God. There's the smile from Mahesh. <laughs> They're going to run it once. Not too much out there for Dr. Lawyer. Dr. Lawyer needs some help. There's a little bit of help. And Mahesh's aces are going to hold up. And he's going to win that pot. 
go back to a funny moment today. Let's look at Hiker. I guess something got... That was when he had a five and he folded the five and Steven was like, you had a five? He folded the five during the knit game. Yeah, no, that was... I was looking for a different moment. We had Hiker do the middle finger. He... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, uh... That was when he put the sunglasses on. Somebody recorded was... over it when I didn't see it. And number 81 today on a special episode of the Lodge live stream, PLO. Probably run PLO about half a dozen times in our show history. Another very nice looking hand for T1000. It feels like he'll probably flop a straight flush. Also, no one seems to be folding any cards that block his ability to flop a straight flush. Hiker comes along. So does Mahesh. We'll go four ways to the flop. 4,300 already in the skillet. Damon gives us three. Couple hearts. <laughs> Hiker with some combo. Three draws. of the four players have a heart draw. Will a heart, another heart come? Can another heart come? And it's T-1000 on the button. It's going to put the pressure on some folks. And none of them have the nut flush draw, so this might work. First in line, Dr. Lawyer. Hold He's going to go all in. Remember when I said it might work? Yeah, I was wrong. Hiker with a wheel draw. And a pair of ducks. Actually, two pair. Deuces and sevens. To go along with this wheel draw. It's just tough because if you're going to call a raise preflop with that hand, you, it, you can't really fold when you flop this, this draw. Hiker will. You're going to win this one, but I have to call. Wow, makes the call. T-1000 needs some running help. This is about as much of a favorite as I've ever seen someone in PLO. Wait, you're ahead. I mean, he's, he's ahead, ahead with a pair of sevens. Oh, Queen you Jack is dead. dead. You have me dead. Super. No, an eight is good for you. Yeah, I have an eight. And a non-heart eight. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's a non-heart eight. It's like non-heart eight. Right this is ridiculous. And he's a non-heart eight, and he's almost yeah. definitely going to get there. Ten of club. Give me a wrap. Jesus. Christ. There we go. Here we go. <laughs> now we got a wrap now. Now we got a shot. Now you have lots of shots. Nine ball. Right. Uh, nice wow. mm. Yeah, <laughs> I, I was taking a swing at that one. <clears throat> hey, I would have won with the 10. I believe Hiker would have won with the wheel. Everybody I believe he had 3-5. I think no, he did. I had, I had queen high heart. <laughs> Black 10, that's, that's the... Yeah, literally the best question yeah. to ask for. I revered the nuts. Yes, he I did have 3-5. 
And like I said, you know, if you're going to play that hand, you can't fold when you hit your draw. That's, that's what got me to do it. I'm greedy. I saw that 4K. <laughs> I wanted it. You guys have roughly 15, 18 minutes left. Okay, guys? Oh. I, also, I also thought it looked like I had aces. So, whatever. It was an interesting dynamic when you, you know the game is winding down. You have two mindsets, right? Either I want to gamble to try and get stuck or win profit last second, or I'm going to tighten up because I don't want to get in the hole when we're about to end the game. It's always fascinating to see who goes into which mindset. Probably not. Okay. You guys? No. Whatever. Cowboys and even uh, if they don't want to, we can go back out there. Uh, San Fran. I don't want to yeah. play this one. Yeah, we can. We can probably try to start a five ten. I don't know. But then we're gonna start with a one case by again. No, if we do the ten or the ten twenty five, I mean it's uncapped. Yeah, but the uh, yeah, yeah, stacks yeah, are one case. One. Let's meet with a nice looking hand. Back to Mahesh and Sumit, two great friends. Kings and ducks are going to be good for Sumit. Yeah. And hand number 82. <laughs> One more time, if you want, ever want to play on the Lodge live stream, a couple ways you can do it. Go to thelodgepokerclub.com slash live stream. Fill out that questionnaire, or one of the easiest ways to do it is reach out to Skull Mike on his Instagram or Twitter, at Skull Mike Poker. We have seats open later this month and into November. So if you've ever wanted to play in the studio under the lights, then this is your chance to play on one of the greatest streams out there. We're one of them. Finished second in the Poker Awards ceremony. We're just getting started here, folks. It's a nice looking 08 hand. Not playing 08. <laughs> Okay for Pila. This time of night, you're going to see a lot of people trying to get some chips back. Yeah. As you mentioned. Mash with a little Canadian boat, right? Three pair. <laughs> Pair now for hiker. It cost him a little money. Uh, There's two. the call. Top two is going to get it from Hesh. So Jesse lodges really big into Halloween. I heard. What are you dressing as? I actually ordered. Well, I mean, should I tell? What I'm dressing up as, or should it be? Is a it a secret? No, it's not a big deal, actually. I, I I ordered a a tig a tiger onesie outfit. To, I'm going to be a tiger. Okay. Yeah. I like that hoodie. Where'd you get it from? Uh, it's Lulu. I had to make sure I ordered that costume. I, I, in the yeah. past, I've always struggled to come up with something, so I I went shopping yeah. online the other day, found this nice tiger costume, and that's what I'm going to wear. It's comfy. 
Yeah, I have one like it, but mine's like a, I don't know, like a whitish green color. I don't know. I like that color. In college, I dressed up as Spongebob. Like, that was a pretty like successful years. costume. Too many people were wearing it. No. <laughs> what are you going to wear, Slick? So now I can put it back. Uh, now you're <laughs> bring it back. I'm, I'm going to come. <laughs> I announced it the other day, so yeah, I'll, it's out. not a secret. I'm yeah, going to be Slicky Bobby. Oh, I like it. So you're going to wear like a, a NASCAR kind of... I've got it all set up. With the Wonder Bread? Yes. Oh, I like it. Slicky Bobby. I like it. If you're not first, you're last. Did Skull announce what he's going to wear? No. Skull is all about secrets. Oh, okay. Big wash, big wash. Yeah. Okay. I have to put them in that Mahesh doing some inventory. Going to lay it down. <coughs> Excuse me. Yes, uh, I've been practicing my slicky body. Here's the deal. I'm the best there is. I wake up every morning. <laughs> I, I piss excellence. <laughs> I piss excellence. There it is. T1000 up 30,600. Let's give him a round of applause there. Stephen Jones, who's left the building, up 7230. Sumit, T-Fund, both winners. Mahesh Swim, Dr. Lawyer, Hiker. Hiker down 11,300. And Swedwacker. Throwing the party down 14,000. Maybe Skull should dress up as baby Jesus and get him the, the tuxedo one like they talk about in the movie. Cal Naughton. <laughs> shake and bake. I was trying to come up with a, a shake and bake thing for like Slick and Skull, but I couldn't come up with one. El Diablo. <laughs> we, should, we could get Skull a... Uh, a Perrier onesie, and he could be the the, the French guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I believe Voodoo. He said Lulu Lemon is where he got that hoodie. They have not sold here at the lodge. Six hundred. Coming down to the final three hands of the week. We will be back Thursday. It all starts Rampage Mariano weekend. You're not going to want to miss it. Just join us Thursday for Heads Up, Rampage, and Doug Polk. Last year, Skull came to, as a cow. With udders. <laughs> then he gave the costume to Masato, who played on stream. Shout out to Masato. That's cool. Oh, 
another never three of good a kind. to have trips in your hand in this game. But I feel like if anyone was likely to hit a set with trips in their hand, it was him. Wheat Whacker bets 1,200. Mahesh, with hopes and dreams, he says, I've got a pair of eights. Uh -oh. He's going to put it all in. <laughs> wow, Mahesh, very optimistic here. Uh, yes, I'm there, Louis, though. Let's see him. Uh, Needs right. some help. Here's our ones. You did see ones, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Somehow a pair of nines is ahead right now. They're going to... Run it once. You're in very good shape. I'm in very good shape. Yeah. In good shape. Yeah. She's got it. I was not expecting. Your nine is good right now, so yes. Eight or a jack here? Need a three. <laughs> Double back with flush. Three, ten, eight. <laughs> or three. What about a jack? With Thanks, chop. Seven. Seven. Or a chop. Yeah, those are chops, yeah. Uh, Lines is good. Sweet Whacker is going to stack Mahesh. Eight of nines win. All right, guys. And Mahesh okay. is going to leave. And coming down to the last two hands of the night, take care of Mahesh. Thank you. Who takes these off? Mahesh <laughs> 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 Who takes the mics off? No one makes me take my own mic off. <laughs> he wants to get out of here. Yeah. Now, he's probably going to be seen at the PLO table mm. when we walk out of here. I was quoting dodgeball. No one makes me bleed my own blood. <laughs> ESPN the Ocho. <laughs> Slick Rick and Jesse... The cage man, Jesse Siegel, Actually, 10. the cage manager here at the lodge. If you ever have any questions, I know that hurts about the cage. Yeah, Jesse oh, is the guy. <laughs> <laughs> and if you ever have any uh, questions about getting money here or how this things work here, feel free to reach out to me. I'm on Twitter. Uh, you can email me, Jesse, at the Lodge Poker Club. Just feel free. I'm, I'm happy to help. Just don't ask him for any free samples of chips. <laughs> don't have any free samples. So meet with the ladies. How you doing, Albert? Swede Whacker with almost Broadway in his hand. <laughs> he looks so cool. What? Daniel looks so cool. <laughs> like see. Hiker, win a nice little pop before he gets out of here. Been a little rough go for him recently. Ace for Swede Whacker. Comes along, hiker, would love a six. Take care, Albert H. Have a good night, Albert. That man lives at Boston Encore. I've never been up there. Is it nice? Been there. Went there in July. Beautiful place. Being a New Yorker and a diehard Yankees fan, I have trouble going to Boston. So, There's the call from Hiker. Hiker needs some help. 
That's, That's not going to do it. That's not going to do it. <clears throat> it's just not Hiker's Night. Yeah, rough night. He's not really going to consider bluffing. Okay. Yeah. Swedwacker wearing that beautiful old style t shirt. Sell him here at the lodge. Got the 400 on the final hand there, Matt. And this is it, folks. We started at 3 p.m. I only have one 400. Four and a half hours later. I think that's fair. Uh, we're coming to the end more, of uh, this yeah. stream. Everyone else combined. Rick, thanks for having me on with you today. Yeah, I do. Jesse? I appreciate it. You cross another yeah, item off my poker sure. bucket list that's and life great. bucket list. There you go. You did a fine job, young man. Thank you. Uh, if I were up like 50K, I'd have a 400 on. $200 straddle. It don't work. I'm happy to keep playing, though. If Thanks, Yoda. Other people want to. Thank you, Yoda. I'm down. Okay. I told you my story about my worst session ever. Did I ever tell you that? Yeah. thousand. Uh, what about the session? I remember yeah, yeah. I came in and I, I was like really arrogant and boastful and like whatever this kid that I battled with I was like whatever you straddle I'll double, double it. He put the 400 on. All you could have been here playing in the game. <coughs> the great Andrew Nimi. They you'll, heard, have, you'll have to watch this one back. Yeah, Rick heard that I chopped a turn in PLO turn with you so he thought I was his PLO expert so he invited me on to do some commentary. Last hand, Samit wants to play the hand. He's going to play the hand. Make the call. It's nice to see some action in our last pot. Couple hearts there. Open-ended straight flush draw. Yeah, look at that block. For board. Sumit. Samit going nowhere. Interesting. Probably want to be raising with that hand. Get your money and you have a lot of equity. Ooh. <laughs> Set now. For swim. Big bet incoming. Pot is already at 4,500. And Swim makes it a pot bet. And the open-ended, tantalizing straight flush draw. It's going to almost put Sumit all in. If he makes the call, he's going to go all in. He's only got 5,400 behind. This is kind of the problem with just calling on the flop. Now he's in no man's land. Also, he knows now that with the king out there, a lot of his straights aren't going to be great, so his equity really shrunk in his mind. But he had so much fold equity if he had raised the flop. <laughs> Understandable fold. I had a in a hard. We want to see the river. Smaller, seven, eight, nine hearts. Let's see the river. Show the seven hearts on the river. There oh, the brick ski. Oh, cool. Good fold there. And yeah, that'll do it. Jesse, thank you, thank you so much. Rick, we'll see my the pleasure. cumulative winnings. T1000 destroyed the game. Up 30,000. Stephen Jones, 7,200. Samit, T Fund, the only other winners. Hiker threw the party today. Sweetwacker came all the way back. He was down heaps. Hiker lost 14,700. There you see the rest. Mahesh down 4,000. Dr. Laurier 5,800. Mazur, who left early, down 6,000. We're going to see some V pips. They don't mean anything in this game, PLO. But there you see them. Hey, folks, another week in the books, another stream in the books. We'll be back Thursday with Rampage and Doug. Heads up, 1020 action. Rampage and Mariano coming in 
all weekend long next weekend. For everybody here at the Lodge, hey, I want to give a special shout-out to Yoda and VW Bug, the greatest moderators. Our production team, second to none. Couldn't do it without them. And for every employee here at the Lodge and all the players, we love you. Take care, everybody.